We're episode, live, dude. So we're Three forty-six. Get... It's not gonna be a dud, dude. Come on, <laughs> sorry. Come on, sorry. It's gonna be good. Episode three forty-six. This is natural, yeah. Three forty-six. Uh, numbers not. Yeah, we also we Please. like gave ourselves about a hundred extra just to look legit. <laughs> That's like when you start comedy. And like, how long have we been doing? Like six years. <laughs> the the goal is in six months to match Rogan. We're gonna make episode one thousand two hundred forty-nine. That's smart. Yeah. Get like, damn, these guys mean business. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, bro? Oh, are we going? Yeah, dude. Oh shit, we're live. We've been live. Oh shit, we've been dude. live this whole time. Yeah, what are you doing here? I don't what are you know. Doing in New York. I don't know what I'm doing. The gayest city in the world, dude. I, damn, <laughs> damn. I mean, there's a lot of gays. You're not, you're not completely wrong. This is uh, last night when we walked through that park. What was that park? Washington Square Park. Yeah, pretty gay mm, down there. I love it. What's going gay. on? Just gay. Just gay stuff. Just like, well, like dudes wearing masks and stuff. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm kidding. I'm Skateboarders, some jugglers. Pretty good, mm-hmm. Francis. You ever go down there? You seem I like lo- a guy. I there. love that park. Yeah, <laughs> Shane acts shocked when I saw one that. time. One time I went there on four twenty, and there was a big group of black guys passing around <laughs> joints. Yeah, and I smoked it with them, and it was the the most diversity I've had. Mm. That's pretty cool. Nice man. That's not- <laughs> but one of them, <laughs> Francis one of them, Ellis, everybody. This is guess, one Francis. of them had a joint. It was like a like one of those a joint, the biggest joint I've ever seen. Really, a bunch of like black a, guys at the biggest joint you ever seen. Of- <laughs> <laughs> and then we were all passing around, and everyone was like Snapchatting themselves, being like, "Look at all the weed I have in my mouth." Damn, dude. Yeah, it was fun. And, and <laughs> that didn't happen to us last night. <laughs> not this porn. No. Yeah, lost. That's like a lost in the hood porn. Well, do you ever, you ever hang out? Yeah, you almost got blacked. <laughs> yeah. Man, the quality on those videos, by the way, I don't know how they do it. Pretty the good. The quality is so good. It's on incredible those quality. Yeah. Those gentlemen. I think are that's ISIS's old producer. Well, <laughs> they invested back into the product. <laughs> <laughs> and our other guest, Ari Shafir, we wanted to get the two least similar guests possible. Mm. It's pretty close. Francis and Ari. <laughs> Harvard Lacrosse, Barstool, Ari Shafir. <laughs> Harvard Lacrosse and Holocaust. Yes. One oh, time yeah. one time I saw uh, right. Ari Sorry. walking out of Home Depot. Do you remember that? Uh yeah, in in on Twenty Third Street. Yeah, and I I, I re- walk across the street to say hi to you, and you had like your arm full of like light fixtures or something, and I was like, "Hey, Ari, uh, I, I good to see you." And you're like, Ugh. "And uh, I, I pretty good impression. <laughs> you were spooked. You were spooked by me." Yeah, and I was like, "I, I work at Barstool. It's been you know we've, we've met each other at the office, and you're like, okay, whatever." And I think you have a light that shines off you. You had a it's cast tough. on your arm too. Remember that. You had a what in Yeah, arm? I remember You had a cast that. on yeah, your yeah, arm. Yeah. yeah. He was injured. What happened? I kill it, dude. No, really? Yeah, I, I could remember. kill it in life, so. <laughs> Did you fall? Yeah, I skied my fucking ass off. <laughs> oh, that's right. <laughs> I lost the race right at the end. But right, maybe you winning. guys are similar. <laughs> there you go. You hurt your arm skiing. Yeah. You yeah, know, it's just fucking fun. You ski? You guys ski? I haven't skied since I, I was thought like I eight. could ski. I went with <clears> a lady up to Killington in Vermont nice. and immediately fell off the lift. And just the laid there. I couldn't get up. Oh. Really? I was like a fat turtle. Top of the lift? At the top of the right? bottom. No, on the way up, I was like, oh shit, I don't know how to ski. And you jumped? And no, it's, no, I, it's like <laughs> off the lift. D- you know what I mean? It, you dismount. Oh, yeah. You, yeah, it just so you went, fell off went straight and fell while everyone, like people had to get out of the way. <laughs> what was your next move? Uh, just stand up. His, it took a very long time to stand up. And then uh, <laughs> just slowly get down the hill. Did you pizza? <laughs> yeah, pizza the whole way. Dude, that's a I moment. didn't fall again, though. Dude, I, I mean, just a had good, to, like, stop every A good seconds. pizza will keep you from falling. Yeah. yeah. That's one of those moments where, like, hey, sorry, we have a noose over here. Like, sweet, thank you, I'll take it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and the girl, yeah, the girl I was with peed her pants when I fell and couldn't get up. It's she so literally fucking wet funny. her pants. Laughing at you. Yes. Oh. Just standing above me, cackling in a snowsuit. That's how every like bad guys from eighty skiing movies made. Dude. <laughs> it's just like, you're just down at the lodge doing. Dude. I'm gonna build a fucking development. I fell off one drunk. It was with Vernazisi. Really? Oh. Yeah. And I, he was on the one ahead of me, and then I went on, and I was like trying to like get my pole, like the high level move where you put your poles underneath you, yeah. and I kept like, and then it just pushed me, and I was just down. 
And I, some guy fucking just shoved my head down because the thing was going to hit me. He's like, fuck, idiot. Yeah. And I'm trying to roll. And they're like, stop the lift. Like, fuck. Oh, no. And then Renazis is like, it's Ari Shafir. Ari Shafir.com. <laughs> you can check out all his dates. I'm like, Come on, dude. Damn. Damn. Not a lot of Jewish skiers, I don't think. No. Seems like you guys. We ski a lot. We just don't really? go high level. We don't go high. We don't go like compete. But yeah, we mm-hmm. all ski. Ski yeah, amateur tennis. skiers, yeah. Really? Yeah. Country one of the one of the best ski lodges in the country is actually called the Stein Erickson in Deer Valley. Mm. Really? Yeah. Never heard I, just I ran into German. Mitt Romney in the waffle. Yeah, have you ever skied there. Jack Frost though? No. Big Boulder? Are these real? <laughs> yeah, they're turf. the Poconos, dude. Sounds oh. like a they're some of the premier skiing. Yeah, if you know a little about skiing, Jack Frost, Big Boulder are the top places in the Poconos, you're... Pennsylvania. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Isn't the Poconos yeah, pretty good? No, it apparently it's not. Right. Remember I told you I can do a black diamond? Yeah, I know you're yeah. wrong. Pocono's black diamonds are like, if you go anywhere else, they're like a I know you square. can't do it. You don't think I'm a black diamond skier? No. Dude, I can definitely. When's the last skied, time you went skiing? I've shredded diamond. Actually, I thought it was when, when I was eight, I went skiing. That's when the ladies. Right. You my took skiing a black stru- diamond when you were the eight? The pants. No, no. Because I did it when I was 14. That was the only other time after that. That's when I was doing it. And uh, on the way up, I was with like some old man. He like was smoking weed. And I was like, can I hit that? He let me smoke weed with him. And I was really? Like, Fuck yeah, yeah. It's four times. Oh, nice. Damn. Crushed black diamond that day. It was it was tight. But the time before that, I got actually, I literally got ran over by a snowboarder, and I cried on the mountain. And I was like, I'm never doing that again. <laughs> he tried to this do is, a. I had fallen. He tried doing a jump and just fucking trucked me. <laughs> this is like uh, one time we were sitting there. Me, O'Connor, and Beezer were in our living room watching mm-hmm. like the X Games run. We were watching snowboarding, and Beezer was like. I can fucking drop in on that and hit that. No we like, dude, what no, idiot. you couldn't. <laughs> what the fuck? And he, dork? to this day, is like, oh, yo, sorry, cool, dude. No, dude, <laughs> Jack Frost, Big Boulder is different. You could do a black diamond there. I went to New York one time up at like up there to ski, and I like, I was like, I can do a black diamond. I had to like just sit on my butt and like slide down. It was terrifying. <laughs> that sounds like mm-hmm. an on location fucking challenge. We do, we could ski. That, that would be sick, mm-hmm. dude. Yeah. I'd this love, winter, I'd I'll love go to see you. What you wear to ski? I bet you. The, I wore this. The I gap, wore jeans. The gap dude. between his goggles and the and his helmet is so wide. What it's helmet, dude? Fuck that! So you wear much a helmet. helmet. Yeah, you're a helmet dude, guy. You, you, you gotta wear Jeff one. Off. No, I don't wear a helmet. You should. You should. Do you no, I'm trying to look. Uh, time out. Did you? He's trying to push this on me. Of course, I ski constantly. You wear a helmet. You have to. I grew up with law now. No, I didn't wear a helmet. What did you want skiing? Dude, we go two years ago. Yeah, man, you wear blue jeans. You wear blue jeans. Oh my god. Yeah, embarrassing. <laughs> Don't you dare wear a scarf. And I know <laughs> I'm not wearing a scarf anymore. You're not delivering mail. True. <laughs> you you and I have actually skied with us the same guy once. That Who? guy out in dude, British Francis Columbia. Francis is obsessed with you, dude. <laughs> you started it. You were like, you two are going to be best friends. <laughs> you never said that. Don't turn on me. You said to track. Remember that time you met at Home Depot? You said that. Yeah. Those are your words. You tried to push the helmet on me also? Because yeah, you were like, what are your, what's your helmet look like? <laughs> Nobody wears a helmet, dork. I'm telling you, your helmet tilt, probably terrible. You, you were the guy in football who looked through the, the bottom tier of the face mask. Am I wrong? What? Dude, no. Yeah, Helmets what? are for pussies, but I'll wear one, though. But it, they're for pussies. There's no way around it. You're a fucking <laughs> yeah. dork if you wear one. Bike helmets, dude. I'd rather I die, dude. No, I'd rather Soder, go brain dead, dude. British Columbia. Hold on a Jeez. second. Soder's actually made fun of me for having the perfect football helmet head. <laughs> <laughs> like in the face mask, yeah. <laughs> dude. You, 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 you can rock a leather helmet yeah. real well. <laughs> so you followed him. Where were you guys? Well, I, I went skiing out at Whistler, and we met. There was a comedy show there that oh, I did, yeah, yeah, John. and it was amazing. So much fucking coke there, dude. All those people. It's at like Whistler. half Australians. All they do is blow. Mm. All they do is blow out every fucking day. Mm-hmm. That's true. And Australians love cocaine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Australians rule. They always get that kind of shit. And then when they finally get anywhere else like it's so fucking cheap here they, can't stop doing it. <laughs> they might pay the most for drugs they might i think in australia everything's like it's probably like prison it's like five times what it should cost that's my opener in australia i'm like you know it's general rule of thumb is the more expensive thing is the better quality is and with that in mind the cocaine in australia must be by far the best in the world <laughs> yeah, <laughs> garbage cut yeah i was in it. i was in brazil and there was australians there and like one of the dudes I was with, he was like, luckily he was like South American. So he went into the favela to buy Coke. No. And these Australian dudes were like so fucking happy. He came back and it was like Jesus coming back, dude, on Palm Sunday. They love it. And they were, I just remember all the Australians were coked out in this hostel. So Well, that could also just be like Australians. Nah, I know. I believe that they were. They but were, they also they were. always have that energy. True. They, know? they vacation. They holiday. Mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. True. Good point. Oh, hey, I brought you guys presents. I forgot. 
Oh, what? Yeah, oh, it's under your chair. Hold on. I thought you were saying like Australians that do that. I was like, hilarious. I thought he was doing a bit. Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. I went to a brothel in Australia at um, <laughs> 10 a.m. on a Tuesday. It was the wrong time. You don't How'd it go. They were. I mean, that's like their. That's like their C squad. You know, everyone else who's who matters has gone off and, to bed. What did you do sexually? Um, we <laughs> did. We didn't. We we sat in the waiting room and they parade out the women one after another. You kind of interview them. them. And we passed on all. Oh, of them. you went and to a no, brothel? I thought you said hostel. And we were so embarrassed that we weren't going to do anything. We left them like fifty bucks. Like, None of these girls. Oh, like ours time out. So you went. You said you. I thought you were saying you went to a hostel. You were no, in a brothel. a brothel. Where at? In in Sydney, Australia. Australia. It's illegal. It's and you hot. saw the women. You said no, thank you. Yeah, they were. It was so bright. I mean, it was so Dude. garish in the middle of uh, ten a.m. on a Tuesday. We actually went straight <laughs> from the. Apples. First of all, I got you all some pink lady apples because everybody nice. likes. Them. Apples. Appreciate I that. Do like this. Yeah, Matt, I know you're into flare, so I got you a fucking geranium. Thank you, man. Whoa, yeah, no dude. Problem. How'd you know? Uh, there we go. Too You got your fucking allergies. Oh, oh whoa, yeah, dude. Wow. Fuck yeah, what man. The fuck. Yeah, how many guests do you have to bring fucking? Beers? You're the only one ever. Yeah, Thanks. man. That was <laughs> don't fucking do awesome. That. Thank no, don't. Not right now, Mike, Francis. <laughs> this is not barstool, dude. Dude, this yeah. isn't fuck around time. I'm sorry, everybody. That's crazy. I'm <laughs> so you were in the brothel, and the women came out, and you're like, "What else you got?" Well, here's what happened. Wow. Francis is I so rich. Just Francis just is just like, "No, next." <laughs> Dude, oh. Even even you would have turned these women what? down. What's I mean, that? what the fuck? fuck? I got you there, me <laughs> bitch. What the fuck, so, man? No, I'm kidding. Dude, I'm kidding. What the fuck? Why are you <laughs> doing stuff like that? <laughs> I thought this was a roast or something. What? what? Dude, no? we just vibe and hang out and like yeah. pump each other man, up, man. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, we don't talk about like is. rejecting prostitutes and spitting on them. I would have made love to them, to be honest. <laughs> I would have paid my money and said, let's go. I well, would. It was, how do you, I don't know how you say that to a human. Just like, no. Yeah. I came in here to fuck for money, but I'm not going to now because of the way you look. <laughs> yeah, dude. I think <laughs> we, th we thought it was like... Um, we thought it was like going into a department store, you know, department where, you're, store. <laughs> where you're like, well, it's been really nice, but we're going to we're going to come back. You window shopped. Yeah, we did. And come back. Francis or, Francis is a lot like O'Connor. Like if he talks about pussy at all, I'm just like, ew, dude, what? <laughs> like, no matter how, no matter. She was lovely. And we had I went down on her. I had oral sex with her. Hmm. Sorry. I'm sorry. That's, yeah, true. I'm That's, being okay. Rude. That's where, okay. No, where are you not. from? I feel bad for what I said. Where are you from? Uh, Maine. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> you know, I mean, wh why? What, what what is it about Maine that I'm wearing on my forehead? I don't know. A redhead, I guess. <laughs> I feel like, is Maine replete with redheads? Are we? Replete? I don't know. You just got a Maine vibe, dude. Yeah, dude. I wouldn't have said Atlanta. <laughs> <laughs> like, that would have surprised me. Yeah, Maine or Alaska would have been. Yeah, Maine or Alaska, Iceland. Yeah, Iceland. There's a lot of them. Um, no, we we the the thing they said in the brothel was they that they, they all the women had two different like modes. Yeah, and they were and they would Sick come up. out and give you their pitch, <laughs> and then they'd be like, "My name's whatever," and I do this I do beast I, mode. No, I do, <laughs> I do the girlfriend experience. No, yeah, that's Ooh. and they were like, "It's very you know sensual. We can cuddle, kiss." Nice oral and all that and, and then all of that <laughs> kind of getting hard go ahead hope you like me you know let me know see you later and then they leave and then the next girl came in and like gave us the same pitch Ooh. and then three other girls came in same pitch and then finally the the madam who was like organizing the whole thing came in and was like all right boys do you find anyone you fancied and we were like well everyone gave us the girlfriend experience was there anything else and she's like well yeah um oh, we've, yeah. we've got the porn star experience but i figured a couple classy new york boys like yourselves wouldn't be up for that what's that one and we were like of, we're, we're at a brothel at 10 a.m on a tuesday of, of course we want the porn star experience she's like it's very naughty you know spanking hair pulling bit of a choke Dude. anything goes bit of a joke. <laughs> and uh we were like yeah that's of course we're not trying to recreate failed relationships with whores he thought you came in at 10 so you could get the whole day's worth yeah we, we, we <laughs> wait we're, we're here to like get the a... evil out so that we're prepared yeah you want to get like you want to get like pegged, you get pegged and shit yeah we're, I, you know <laughs> spank me 
Just do your worst. I, I need. Yeah. yeah. Fuck you me. wait. 10 a.m. Like, were you up all night, or were you just? We like... came straight from the airport, so we were very oh, jet lagged, and we actually to the point where Dude, we brought air even... airplane butt and dick Dude, to a brothel. Yeah. We didn't even we didn't even dick dick and butt go to break. our Airbnb. We came with our luggage, and they were like, "You can't." And stay then you here. turned them down. We were like, "You'll see." Uh, and, and then we left with our luggage. We had to roll. We had to get it out of the coat bag. There, the coat closet. Our our rolling suitcases. How long of a flight is it? Seventeen hours. And then you went straight to a brothel. Yeah, we went straight Whoa. from there to the brothel. Because we've been excited. We've been talking it up on the flight. Yeah. We were excited. I'd never been to a brothel before. <laughs> so embarrassed. He's <laughs> so <Yeah>. terrified. <laughs> How could you ruin this? Start it over. Start the podcast yeah. over. Is that noise? I wonder if they have a. Uh... They should start like a Love in Australia themed brothel where you go on a Love you in just Australia aut- autistic? date. Yeah, you pretend to be aut- it's an autistic experience uh, yeah. where you pretend to be on Love in Australia and be like playing Switch and shit. Yeah. <laughs> and then smash. Dude, those fucking losers porn from that experience. show, they could make what? hella money being a porn star. <laughs> the <autistic. laughs> yeah, they could make big losers. brothel chicks. Dude, they could sell it and, because they're like celebrities those and also schlubs. want a fucking feather in your cap. True. That would be that would be a quiet sensation. Yeah, one of them broke his <laughs> yeah, Very quiet dude, sensation. If Thomas was who's the one who? There's Michael. Michael. Michael, Michael had a sex the, tape, dude. There's also oh. uh, no. The best one would have been who? Mac, <laughs> the really nice guy. He's like, oh wow, yeah, it's such a lovely day. He's so happy. His would have been. You ever see the porn where it's like made for like sensuality? It's like couples porn. Yes. He would have made nice. <laughs> <laughs> Mark would have made nice it's, sexual it's like, porn, which wasn't attractive to me, but you know, what's it called? It. <laughs> it's as high quality as black is. It's if not more so. It's very gentle. What autistic? The 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 like romantic <laughs> romance porn. Yeah, I know yeah. what you're talking about. They like kiss for like an hour. New oh, Biles? that's the oh, yeah, 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 dude. Yeah, new Biles. New Biles. I yeah. got it. New Biles isn't romantic. Shut that's up, dude. It's fucking their like stepsister. Like, no, new Biles rules. Is it? <laughs> new Biles is high quality. Now there are some. Now there are some romantic new Biles. I promise. I promise. It's gentle. There's a lot of. There's a I lot promise. of. You know that's child porn light. Is New it? Biles is child porn well, then light. Maybe that's not what I'm. No, saying. it is. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't worry about it. Okay. It's good. It is high quality. You're right. It's the okay. next best like, thing. New Biles is yeah. Mm-hmm. It's, it's yeah. It's it's uh. What's the? What's like Michelob some... Zero or whatever? Yeah. It's like non-alcoholic yeah, beer. It's like Odules. Yeah. Yeah. Odules. It's Odules. Yeah. It's the Odules of child porn. Mm-hmm. New Biles. Yeah. Okay. No, it's the one where it's like gentle for the first like five minutes and then they go hard. Yeah, we're mm-hmm. thinking of something else. When it's like this kissing, the, the I love you, dappled, I love you. Yeah. dappled sunlight. Yeah. When it's, they're like, I love you so much and they kiss for like sir. 10 minutes. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's yeah. not New Bows, dude. That's Is like someone fucking their stepsister, Brett. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can New see had the, that. I promise. Did they really? I I'm, I'm with Shane on this. I'm, one. Dude, I'm certain. Break down the, I've what was come the plot. To you, it. What was the plot you watched? Break it down. Uh, it's like it's Cooking literally like in the, the title of it's like loving, really? romantic. Mm-hmm. Yeah, really. I didn't search for that because I know <laughs> fucking queer. <laughs> mm. I think I'm not searching for love and shit. True. Mm-mm. No, I search hardcore sex X, i just type xxx dude. yeah boobs i, I, yeah. I, I just go for crossover i go for like new Biles and bang bus shut so up. it's like gentle gentle fucking in a van shut up derosa <laughs> <laughs> those those scenes always start the girl is the cooking eggs in the kitchen and it's a nice kitchen and she's wearing her white, her husband, boyfriend's white T-shirt, and then silk Ooh, pajama, like gotcha. panties. And then he comes in, and he's he's like rubbing <laughs> his bleary, sleepy eyes. And then next oh. thing you know, they have morning. So he's fucking hard. Yeah, that's it. That's like how it that. starts. Damn. Yeah, I'm so she made a mistake like getting out of bed. She, if she wanted, she just like stayed in bed. We're already in bed. I've been trying to tell them that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just chill. You're already in the position. I mean, do what you yeah. want with your life, but true. <laughs> Hell yeah. This is awesome, dude. Oh, I'm having fun. I wish that old guy would have stayed in here for a while. Longer. Yeah, it was, it was, <laughs> I didn't even see him. We've got a very live old. audience. I've been in the flow state. Mm. You guys ever got hookers? I have not. <laughs> it's like, come on. I didn't know. Good I went man. to the strip club one time with people, and uh, they freaked out because I came out. And I was like, yeah, I just titty fucked that lady. And they're like, what the fuck? And I was like, you don't fuck these ladies? <laughs> they're like, no. And I was like, no, I just find the ones I can fuck. That's what I used to do. But, you know, Whoa. obviously I'm married now. I have a kid. But. Yeah, if I was an animal, dude. <laughs> yeah. But I you couldn't, take, you I take couldn't. the shot. You take the chances. You're like, you can try. Tell. Do you like ease it in or how do you do it? Okay. So if you're if you're okay. going to a strip <laughs> you're going to a strip club and you want to like get the, you know. The worst. Suck. Yeah. If you're there because you need to be there, there's two different things. You can be having fun. I used to go there because I needed to be there. All right. <laughs> yeah. So like yeah, I needed to be there. So you go in there and you know, you shoot the breeze and you're like, oh, let's do a dance, and you just go like 
I don't know. I, you know, I don't really just want to go back. To, you know, you kind of just peppered into the conversation. You're like, I don't know. And then they'll come out and be like, yo, it'll be worth your time. And you're like, yeah, that? but they always say worth your time. But it's like, what do you mean by I that? I say, what's it's that? Just, what's that mean? Oh, you go right at it. Yeah. Oh, I go, okay. what's that mean? And they're like, oh, and if they're vague at all, I go, no. And then at that point, if they're, they'll say, yeah. Fuck, yeah. That's very aggressive to sex workers. Yeah. No, it was no, no, no. I'm, I'm gentle. No. I, you know, I'm gentle. Dude. <laughs> I know the you're gentle. most yeah. consensual. You know, I, think I, I think I actually freak them out. I would like be so comfortable afterwards and start chopping it up with them. They'd be like, "Get the fuck out yeah, of here, dude." Yeah, it's uncomfortable. One lady asked me for a ride to Rite Aid afterwards to get condoms. I was like, "Nah, I'm not taking it." That's like a whole. That's a problem. That's a different life. I'm yeah. like, no, I don't want that. You staying in that life? Yeah, yeah. Once she gets in your car. <laughs> Once you run you're one errand person. with a hooker, it's a Freaky Friday situation. <laughs> yeah. You're just in that life forever. It's like a tick. <laughs> yeah, it just yeah. attaches to your civic. Yeah. You know, it's like, where's my registration for my car? Like, fuck, she took it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Francis, have you ever had sex with a hooker? I have not. No. The, the what? That was your one time and you didn't do it? I've ever Girls love when you, if you tell, like, once you get out of, like, you know, the wild stages of, like, dealing with prostitutes. When you get like a nice girlfriend, they love hearing about when you're with prostitutes. <laughs> you gotta tell. <laughs> you gotta tell them. You gotta be honest. They get so turned on by it, dude. Oh god! It's like Fifty Shades of Grey for them. What type of stuff do you tell them? Just tell them everything. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, I used to go to the wish. I used to get off the mega bus and go to the wishy washy. It was fucking sick. Uh, mm. Did you ever fuck them? I'm like, no, I only got a hand job. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Every girl asks if you've been with a hooker. It's like no. a weird thing to do. Yeah, really? girls ask that. Guys ask, have you ever fucked a black guy? Yeah. <laughs> hmm. well, Both of you are kind of like, I hope it's a yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get turned I on real quick. Yeah, it's <laughs> it's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, it's pretty. You should do it once. It's a cool experience. That's, that's what my friends have said. And <laughs> it's a lot like sex. I think it's it's more like I haven't been to the places where it's so calm. Like you, when you go to Columbia, I've heard it's. New York has some hookers. Yeah. But where? Like, how do you? Well, find they shut them? down. Backpages was a big one. They shut Back it down. Pages. Thank God, dude. Why they shut it down? Trump shut it down. I don't know. He just what? Because it was fucking. It, it was messing up hardworking Americans, dude. <laughs> I was out there trying to work, and that would just halt. Trump shut down hard. back pages. Yeah, dude. Or during his administration, he was rolling up the pedophiles. During his administration, he got shut down. That's because they're fucking kids. Doesn't mean everybody wants to fuck kids. That's they, ruined, they ruined Pornhub too. Why? What's Pornhub? They now? took down they took a bunch down, of cool stuff because a bunch of guys were jerking off to kids. Yeah, man. <sighs> They're taking everything, dude. Yeah, I was now, joking. Off menthol kids, cigarettes so. are gone. Menthol cigarettes are gone. <laughs> That was actually they're not really though. No, I swear to God, I think they're banning them. They are. Yeah, what a yeah. tough time to be a black barbecues. Pedophile. The barbecues at public <laughs> parks are out. God. <laughs> it's never been worse to be a black pedophile. <laughs> <laughs> they came out and said that too. They're like the African Americans have been disproportionately harmed by menthol cigarettes. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. yeah. All right, man, come on. So that's and so Hennessy, fucking weird. Like, and yeah, that's yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. weird. What? That's a weird. Uh, that's a weird way to put it. Like, they didn't know. And probably p- police. I mean, right? They're, they got a lot. Actually, too. really. Uh, never mind. What? No. I like what about it. the crush. They can just still do the crush. So you can make your own decision. That's a good point, dude. It should be like red pill, blue mm, pill. Yeah. They sell the tips, uh, pom- the king palms. You can do the crush, but who knows how long they'll be here for. But yeah, they should get. They should do it on you. You get a warning, and they can crush if you want to crush. Yeah, and mm-hmm. if they catch you, that's a ticket. <laughs> yeah. that's true. They catch you crushing. This, one's a this, is, second one's a this is clearly yeah. just another way to arrest black people. They're like true. we're gonna make true. menthol cigarettes illegal. Remember after slavery, they made no loitering laws, so yeah, they could true. still get their like cotton picked. <laughs> so like you can hang around. I was like, well, we can't get jobs. I was like, You're, come on, yeah. I got a job. Let's right go. Now. Yeah, yeah they gotta do that. They gotta figure out a way to still like your taillights out. I'm like, I'm not even driving. Like. Yeah. yeah, this is yeah. the this is the yeah, point. It's a little too easy. Little, this is yeah. the most obvious. Like, if you had to pick one, menthol. If you like make one thing illegal that just yeah. black people are gonna get arrested for. Yeah, they're called Cadillacs in jail. Oh yeah, come through with the Cadillacs. Damn. That's all the black dudes call them. Also, white trash. What? Oh yeah, they cross. Oh menthol. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah man. Yeah. I mean, dude, that's that's a secret of the universe. Yeah. Yeah. Black white dudes and white trash kind of fuck with the same stuff. <laughs> they should I, just get along. Stop they should get along. The, Maybe Bill Clinton. It's the <laughs> cooling mechanism that makes your throat less irritated, which makes you want to be able to smoke more. Hmm. Which is why they're so harmful. It's minty. Yeah. Is that the, what I like a menthol once in a while. Yeah. Is that why they're harmful? That's what I've heard. Huh? Like a regular cigarette. People. I heard they put fiberglass in your throat when I was twelve, and I've been running too. with that yeah. ever since. With yeah. Just menthols. I mean, it's a or it's something I heard when I was. 12. I heard that about all. So, so I heard about dip. Too. Really? Yeah. Fiberglass. Yeah. Mm. 
Shit. And I kept that until I was about 30. <laughs> I was like, yeah, it cuts your mouth up, and then the tobacco Five gets in there. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, you're retarded. I was like, what? Sure do, you ever, do you dip? Or are you dipping? I had to. I had to stop, but I still dip like uh, Zin. It's like a nicotine pouch. Is the that the pouch. snooze? I think I don't know. The I'm not toasted sure. stuff from Sweden? No. Do you spit still? No. Oh, that's that's probably the it's snooze. Stuff. You probably know about the snooze, the right? Spit, the spit is like, that's like, you're not yeah, coming is, in my car if you're spitting. You don't spit. That's good. Yeah, yeah it's tough to open. You, you, go to, you go to Sweden and, and those the Scandinavian countries, the, the women do this too. What? Yeah, I heard about they have They pack the snooze in the lips. It's like Give a, a shot, But you don't spit snooze, right? You just put it upper between your gum and your lip. I just had top. dental surgery on Ooh, this. Oh, don't do that. Don't about do the that. Other definitely project. don't do that. Don't do anything. Yeah, it'll yeah, burn. Yeah, definitely don't do that. Yeah, that would hurt like hell. Yeah. I'm going to give it a rip. I yeah. like, rip I, it, I like France these every once nuts, in a while. Dude. Yeah, dude. <laughs> am I? Power. Yeah, I like it. Up, dude. I've always liked it. Yeah. But, but I, I was asking why am I nuts? Because I, oh. love, I love when you say stuff like that. Because you're just... You're just fucking throwing caution to the wind, dude. I, yeah. I can't tell you how much I want another bite of that apple, but I've held off. Do it. You guys told me not to. It's very crispy. I don't want to choose your life for you, dude. What did Francis? What did you major in at Harvard? Uh, government with a focus on the Middle East. Really? Wow! Yeah. You wanted to bring down the Muslims? Yeah, man. No, I wanted to work for the CIA. True story. Really? What are the CIA up to? Aren't they bringing down the Muslims? I think they are among them. That's one of their goals. You would you would have dug in nicely. They would have never thought you were an operative. <laughs> 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 well, you know. You're right. <laughs> Do you ever see that movie, uh, Bridge of Spies? No, it wasn't. Bridge. What was the one with Leo, Leonardo DiCaprio? Yeah, where Catch Me If You Can. Not Catch Me If You Can. Yes, yep. that's the no, one. Siriana. You guys are way. That's got to be is it. Is Siriana or the one with like, Russell Crowe? No, um, the one with Russell Crowe. <laughs> yes, yes, you're right. Thank you, Gladiator. <laughs> <laughs> What's eating Gilbert Grape? No, Damn, I, we're doing it. The cast so, is too litty. So. <laughs> Middle Eastern Studies, U.S. Government. And you no, went to Middle East. Did government. they tell you who did 9-11 in college? <gasps> no. Fuck, it's bullshit. It's secret no. safe, Ari. <laughs> <laughs> you edit that out, please. What kind of shit did they teach you about? Well, I'll... He said I, yes. I, you know, the, <laughs> I, I tried to learn Arabic, but it was too hard. True. It was fucking hard. You Do you remember any words? Barak uh, uh you What's just that made mean? that up, no, dude. That was racist as hell. <laughs> no, that means, uh, like, and then there's, you know, inshallah. And then, obviously, uh, go with Inshallah. Yeah. Inshallah. Uh, yeah. Kleb. You, you, now you're making That's it. a dog. What? Kleb. Okay. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> My brother in law is an Arab. I fucking hate him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it makes me sick, dude. I might join the CIA now to go there and fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see that new CIA commercial? No, join the CIA. What? Yeah. No. Oh, the girl one? Did what you the see fuck? it? Is it? You're talking about Homeland? No, it basically <laughs> is. It, really? Claire, There's Claire a, Danes. I don't know what it is. There's like an ad for the CIA. It's like what? a video of this Latina woman. Yeah. She Latinx. literally is like, I am Latinx. And she's like, I'm a, she's like, I suffer from anxiety disorder. She's just like one of those, she's a woke. And she's joining the CIA. And she's in the CIA. What the fuck? Why would they? Why would they? And use they're advertising it. They're like, look like how the, powerful these kick-ass women are in the CIA. Wow, it's insane. Whoa. I don't Whoa. understand. Are it, they? Dude, are they you, saying like? You yeah, can they're have... trying to destroy the family. They're going to take all of the wives and put them in the CIA. Obviously, this is the next level. <laughs> it's the crazy. And also, every single military commercial is like, "I'm a black woman in the Air Force." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? Those commercials are doing it. Nobody knows how to be what. So they're it's just like, like go, oh, black go, stuff. We'll do black get stuff. Get white trash. <laughs> <laughs> Especially having to. the military be woke. They like just come out of like bombing a small yeah. village, and they're like, "What are we doing, black ladies?" All right. They nice. used to properly so target words while bombing a village. <laughs> yeah. They had the best white trash ads. It was like, "Are you ready to climb a mountain and fight a fucking dragon?" We do yeah. more. Yeah, and we every more poor fun. white yeah. guy was like, "Hell yeah. yeah!" Are you ready to face your worst tattoo? <laughs> 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 now it's like, yeah, yeah. Damn, you dude. See this they have a CIA girl I commercial. See it now. Uh, can we pause this and watch Kim? Possible. I need. To, I need you guys to see this. Yeah, you don't know how he's Cardini. If you can't pause it, you're fired. Just keep playing it. Edit it well, just keep playing and edit. It's edit it. Yeah, just edit it out. <laughs> oh, nice. You can edit right with the point where we're all saying edit it. That'd yeah, timestamp. That good. Yeah, good. Like edit point. No, this is it. This is it. When I was 17, I quoted Zora Neale Hurston's "How It Feels to Be Colored Me" in my college application essay. The line. That Damn. 
We going back in? Yeah, think, Cody, yeah. don't worry about getting him a mic. Fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, cut him off. Ice fucking cold. It might have been funny to include him after the edit. True. Just have DeRosa sitting down. No, it's fine. It's all good, man. Don't worry. You're Dude. doing okay. So, Francis, what do you think about that bitch that stole your job? Oh, yeah, we're still recording. <laughs> I mean, I find it strange that they are True, effectively... That next woman. bumped you out, dude. Extending a, a beckoning <laughs> yeah. hand to people with anxiety to yeah. what has to be one of the most anxiety-inducing jobs. CIA? They had, yeah. me, they had me at Latino. I was like, oh, sure, sure, sure. But then it's like, I'm also pretty fucked up. Shouldn't <laughs> 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 like, you guys get her a lady? gun? Yeah. What's this gendered? I do remember on the so application strange. when I applied, they said that speaking uh, another language is a plus and that the languages they wanted you to be fluent in were Russian, Arabic. Mandarin, um, Portuguese, and yeah. Arabic. Nice. Yeah, we got to fuck with Brazil. Those are the, Brazil and it's like, okay, well, these are clearly our, our enemies, I guess. And I didn't know that Brazil was a country. Because they're the concrete company we got to take down. The concrete company. I didn't know. Really? I didn't know the CIA had a presence in Brazil or, or Portugal. Brazil's all huge. around the world, of course. But yeah. like, the United oh, States government can drop a bomb anywhere in the world in two hours. But I would not have <laughs> thought right? that we were <laughs> like the other three made a lot of sense to me. But I would have thought like you know North Korea. True. Ahead. They didn't even Hebrew, mention that. They put Arabic. Portuguese ahead of that. Dude, but what Brazil... if they sent you to North Korea and you had to pretend fully? Like go full makeup and everything, <laughs> pretend to be yeah, Korean yeah, yeah. for the government. What'd they you do? They would it? kill you. What'd you do? What'd you do? It? Pick surface, and I got out of for blackface, and I was like, No, 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 no. 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 Was not blackface. This would be Korean face. face. Come on, man. Brown face? face? No, it'd be Korean face. Mocha latte face. Don't make me say it. it'd be Korean right. face. They're pretty okay. fair skin. North yeah, Korea right. is very fair skin. Yeah. You would you put on the makeup and just like? Would you have plastic surgery? I love getting dressed up. I I would have had country though. I sure do. Sure love my country. You would do it. Take a rubber bullet for it. You know? Did you? Oh, <laughs> I thought you were out protesting. But you know, oh, speaking of America, um, you know what's really cleaned up is, yeah. and this is not a bit, the DMV. Sure. Have you guys been there in a while? Uh, no, haven't It's been. gotten good. Really? They've streamlined it. Yeah. You, you ever get your, you get your new real ID, the enhanced no, ID? I got it yet. I got a regular yeah. ID. Yeah, you got to get it. What was your experience, your last Unbelievable. Experience really? Dude, they're the most competent people. I was in and out in 10 minutes. Well, they hire white people? <laughs> No. Hot chicks. <laughs> we're not they, going there. They stopped hiring like, Latinx. Serious question, Because yeah, the, the place near me, they did have a lot of people with Down syndrome. You think they fired them <laughs> just for your your pleasure there, your experience? Oh, there goes my SNL gig. No, they did. Uh, they had no for real. They, they used to have them the one near me. So this you're, you're one, telling me they they caught the it made some changes around there. Well, they had I think they had a few of them, but those guys were just squirting hand sanitizer when you walked in. That's nice. all they were That's doing. That's pretty tight. Yeah. So they did a little reassignment. A little Don't throw me away. <laughs> <laughs> Don't throw me away. Yeah. Yeah. You think they had like efficiency experts come in and be like, what do you do here? <laughs> what would you say? <laughs> Man. That's nice. I'm glad you had a good... How long did it take you? Top to bottom. T- 10 minutes. In what? Yeah. It's because of COVID. It's because of COVID. They're getting people in and out. True. Yeah, they were True. flying. True. It was Im- they it was told really all the impressive. employees, like, hey, do you mind? Just during COVID. Just during COVID. Can you do your job? <laughs> <laughs> I, was, <laughs> like, all right. I was so nervous because I, I was screwed. I didn't, I don't, I lost my social security card and my driver's license. And those are the two things you need. Yeah. One or the other. You need, a, you need a driver's license to get a social security card. And you need right. a social security card to get a driver's license. That's yeah. what I thought. You were, you were unidentified for a minute. I came in I, with document a W-2, <laughs> like a, a, a telephone or electrical bill for my current apartment. And then, I swear to God, my college transcript with my old student ID. And what that was the GPA? Enough. 3.31. Damn, you brought a Harvard transcript. Sure in? did. Damn. She didn't even look at it. Somebody I was like, you sure you don't want to <laughs> take a peek? Damn. Pass it around back there. You've never seen one of these. <laughs> <laughs> touch it. No, seriously, take a look. Uh, take a look. Take a look at the class. Damn. Do you ever feel guilty walking around New York being this white? <laughs> you know. Like, are you ever like, everybody hates me now? Well, only in comedy they do. True. They don't like me they sure here. Do. <laughs> they don't like me here. <laughs> they hate white people. They're like, what are you doing here? You, you got off on the wrong stop, dude. What about dyeing your hair? I don't. I don't think I need to. It's it's getting blonder as I age, so the red is fading, which is good. It used to be way redder. Was so he red. actually started dying it. You should, go jet, you should go jet black. The last yeah, you time you should go jet black and leave the eyebrows. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the last time I saw Shane, well, not the last time, but one of the times I was hanging out with Shane and and Andrew Schultz, 
they were both uh they pulled me aside at a party and they were like pulling up old pictures of me and they were like dude you used to be so ugly like what no did you... i didn't say you were ugly I you were like you've you you've glown up you've, you've no i didn't, I, I wouldn't say glow up obviously this was schultz sure but you you were you <laughs> were there you were like yeah you tell him you tell him and you were saying yeah. that to him. you were egging him on well i was excited to see you yeah me too it's I, fun no no I no i meant it i was excited to see you getting bullied well sure <laughs> that's so fun <laughs> yeah, yeah, tomato because he does he does he's a nasty little fuck dude yeah he'll oh. give it back home oh, really yeah, this guy Francis is actually <laughs> deceptively mean. Oh, come on now. <laughs> he comes at you with that Harvard, like, who's the dude you from, scum. Who, who's the dude from Succession, Tom? Who's in the Tom. office with <laughs> I love that guy. <laughs> I saw him at uh, Mayalino once by yeah. himself. He was eating by himself. What? Which one was Tom? The dude who would always fuck with Greg. He was like hands. the nephew who was, or the guy who was like married into the family. Oh, the door, but idiot. But then he's like super devious. <laughs> he played. Uh, no, no, no. That's Greg. That's cousin Greg. That's cousin Greg. Tom yeah. was his boss. Tom was the one who was always bullying. Oh yeah, like, yeah I'm just yeah. razzing he you, bro. Was always bullying. Yeah, like, yeah. He'd yeah. be like super serious. He was like, no, I'm just joking. Yeah. Gay, sexually harassed. <laughs> gets cucked which by is the coolest thing you can do. Cucked by his redheaded uh, wife or whatever. Oh yeah. She's like, we have an open relationship, and he's like, I don't really like that, but okay. Yeah. Oh, we didn't um, even talk about the, the commercial. No, we didn't talk oh, about Oh, the Latinx. Yeah, we didn't even address that, dude. What did you think of that? It was too long, first of all. Yes, yeah, it, it was, was, too, it was way too long. Yeah, way slow. too long. But it you was need like, to I command your space. Get to the fucking cell. Yeah. yeah. They didn't really sell it. They didn't go like, join the CIA. It just showed a picture of CIA. Yeah, yeah they're, they're walking across. across. Dude, it's so the, funny the how you have these like, you know, multinational corporations, the CIA. You Let's say you can assume they have perpetuated some massive amounts of evil. On the me And now they're fucking woke. It's like the CIA's woke. Everybody's Pepsi woke Co. on the surface. Yeah, they're but like, it's like look. Pepsi bu like buys like lakes in India. And they're like, <laughs> we tell you we love Mexican guys? And you're like, dude, you guys are perpetuating yeah. global evil. You know what You know what the CIA has done for me is it has made me very wary of drones. Oh, no. What do you, you mean? mean? You ever see now. a drone yeah, and like... Uh, get, in get in here. You ever see a drone like just out and about and you're like... Is that gonna? Is that looking at me? Oh, yeah. You ever, you, ever, you see that now? Wait, they probably never stop with them. Um, I've seen a drone hour out and about. I think it's Ari Shafir. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Great you start. fucking drunk, dude. <laughs> <laughs> nice sandwiches, you drunk piece of shit. No. You could have got a sandwich while you're up there. Oh, you guys are being. This is great. I've, I've been sitting over there watching this. Yeah, it's been yeah. Fun. Seriously, it's been fun. I've been but for real, it. why wouldn't he help? We want some sandwiches. You sandwiches. think you need? I knew that was coming. You think you need another it. sandwich, dude? You want to talk body types? Huh? I'll destroy you in front of your lady Shut right up. now. <laughs> you want me to eviscerate you? Grow soft. Grow soft. Grow <laughs> soft. Grow <laughs> soft. Grow <laughs> soft. <laughs> No, no, but I, it stopped at, uh, why don't you just come in during the normal hours? I don't understand I, why it's I, so hard I, for you I, to play by the rules. I didn't know when the no hours. No one comes <laughs> to the comedy club at 4 p.m. No, it's not. You're not coming for comedy. You're you're coming to the sandwich, the comedy club for a sandwich. It's a different <laughs> thing. It's a sandwich thing. What is happening? Yeah. Are you, you a big sandwich has, guy? He stopped doing stand-up, but now he does sandwiches. No, no, no I've seen you cooking up. things. Oh, I'm sorry. Time. I thought you stopped. Huh? You told me you stopped. You did I did stop. Totally stop. Did you stop? <laughs> what the fuck? This guy bumped me last week. Did he? Swear to God. He's right back to comedy. Did you really? You bumped Francis? You came back just to bump yeah, Francis. Yeah, he was working the line at Subway. So get out of my way, buddy. I'm here making salami sandwiches now. <laughs> are you, are you going to Jared? Are you going to Jared for your thing? <laughs> that guy. Do you hire multinational? I drop in at Quiznos now. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you a hammer. Huh? <laughs> what happened? It's Cinco de Mayo, dude. It is Cinco de Mayo. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm gonna swallow this dip. Yeah, no, I, we 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 might have had a few today, but whatever. You know. I'm glad you dropped in. I was hoping you would. Yeah, well, we were I could see there. you were itching to get involved. No, we were sitting over there watching the whole time. We were laughing, dude. It was uh, fun, man. It was really fun. Yeah, right? when I heard you were here, I was excited i was like oh yes dude, oh, dude, i, I was excited all. when i knew you were coming in yes because francis came in and i go what are you doing here he goes i'm doing our um our i'm doing shane's podcast with ari and i go dude so shane's coming in here and he goes yeah and i was like i was like all excited to nice to see you yeah mm. god what a sweet guy yeah that wasn't yeah. i it was different than the reaction when i told you i was doing really shane's podcast no it's not no it wasn't it was vastly not. different it was just like hey what's going on I was like i'm doing shane's podcast and you're like oh Mm. The first time you come knew. on here to fib, the, the first exposure I ever had. To no, Joe, I already knew that you were. Why'd you ask me what I was doing? Here? Huh? Well, hold on, Francis is gonna say he followed you around. No, no. <laughs> the first, the first time I ever saw Joe DeRosa was when he was on stage at Madison Square Garden. 
Yeah, Whoa. I swear to God. That was huge. I sold that out. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, you crushed. <laughs> I sold crushed. out two shows. He's uh, Bill Burr experience. was there to open for me. <laughs> 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 they went they went top to bottom there. You did massive. Yeah. Flip the lineup. Yeah. Yeah, it was wild, dude. It was so cool. I headlined it, was a great it show. and uh and Bill Burr opened for me. Mm-hmm. He did pretty good. Mm-hmm. But, <laughs> he did uh, all right. <laughs> they seem to like him. I think he has you think he has you think he has it? No. <laughs> 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 I've heard the, I've heard the sandwiches are great. They are. They're good. I've heard. Dude. Why would you stop doing them at a certain hour though? It's a pop up. It's not a rest like 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 it's not a restaurant. It's a pop up inside right. of a restaurant. What's a pop up? Just make a the pop-up fucking A pop up means sandwich. like you're doing like a like a highlighted thing inside of a functioning restaurant. Like you can't do it all. That you have to do it during certain hours so they're able to maintain and accommodate. Yeah, but so. isn't a pop up sort of a novelty moment? Where, that, exactly. Where, but if you're doing it consistently, would you call it a pop up? Well, that's what I'm saying. A novelty wouldn't be we do it all day. Think, every yeah. day. <laughs> you got a novelty it. is we do it for a, a, a you know a, a succinct number of hours. You just see, yeah, I see. I yeah. see. Investigate the show. Yeah. Very limited yeah. window sandwich chore. That's exact. That's what makes it a novelty. Yes, right? I see. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Oh, this is yeah. it. Aren't you Arabic? Huh? Aren't you Arab? Like I'm mostly Arab. Yeah. Oh, oh wait, 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 you're one. Where from? Uh, Egypt. Lot yeah, of just like my brother-in-law, that motherfucker. Yeah, dude, he <laughs> yeah. sucks, dude. I don't like him either. <laughs> I'm, I'm more so dork. Do you not actually get along? No, he's brother? awesome. Oh, okay. He's great. Good, good, yeah. good. Yeah, he's the man. That's cool. I haven't mm-hmm. met. I truly have not met an Arab I didn't like. <laughs> They're no. kind of always They're the awesome. shit. Mine are uh, uh, I'm I'm not Arab. <laughs> no, I know, but no shit, dude. No. <laughs> <laughs> Look how mad I got. They might not like you. <laughs> oh no, they don't like me. My buddy, <laughs> he's Moroccan Jew. His his brother married a Palestinian chick. Moroccan Jew. Uh-huh. Bur- yeah. Berbers. And, Berbers. No, no. And uh, and uh, <laughs> the, the families do not like each other. And then after um, remember they they uh shot up that place for making that cartoon. Yeah. Yeah. Charlie mm-hmm. Hebdo. Muslims. And then, and then uh, all, Muslims. all his Facebook friends are <laughs> through his, through his um, brother in law's, like, brother, I mean, sister in law's family. They were all like, you know, you shouldn't make fun of. <laughs> they were, oh, none dude. of them were like, that's fucking terrible. Exactly. Like, uh, you get kind dude, of, I worked, you know? I worked next to this guy when I was at Ardmore Toyota. This guy, oh, I shouldn't have said that, but edit that part hey, out. Edit that part in, please. Huh. Uh, <laughs> this, uh, I think he was Syrian, or no, he was Iranian. Mm-hmm. And when the Pulse nightclub shooting happened in Orlando, the guy shot up a gay bar, I was sitting next to him at work and he was like, Yes, but on one side, <laughs> they shouldn't have been committing those sins. <laughs> I was like, yo, you can't tell anyone that opinion. You yeah. can't tell anyone. There's, There's no, no other you're, side. I'm sorry, you're the fuck quiet. Yeah. You, can't, you just can't let that I was like, yeah. dude, I respect it. It's pretty funny <laughs> that you think honestly, that way. I like you having an opinion. Yeah. Uh, but just- Ari, Ari had the funniest tweet of all time. You might have had the funniest tweet of all time when Bernie Madoff died. Oh, that was great. <laughs> it was so funny because you got in all the shit yeah. for the Kobe tweet, right? Yeah, you're going to bring that this up? Is so, no, hold on. This is so funny. This is part out, please. Ari? No, don't cut this out. This is so funny. This is so funny that Just Ari... Just him saying it's funny. <laughs> and you so liked it. That, you liked the Kobe tweet. That black dudes were calling me and going, I got to give up to Ari. This is so funny. <laughs> when, when Bernie Mayo turned and Ari goes... Normally, I would trash this man who was terrible for dying or whatever. And he goes, but I've learned my lesson. All life is precious. (laughs) 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 And and we need to salute Bernie Madoff right now. I was like, dude, that was like one of the funniest fucking tweets I've ever read. Uh, You know what? I just I had a joke before that about uh, I was thinking, you know, like the Muslim guy I was working with was like, but they shouldn't have committing those sins. It'd be funny if white guys defended school shootings and shit. Like that, the same way like Muslims occasionally they do. Should they should have been at that shopping center. They should have been, been, like, <laughs> <laughs> been at that fucking movie. Why, you know? so Why are they seeing the Dark Knight? <laughs> what were those kids doing in social studies, <laughs> <laughs> Edward? <laughs> I mean, on one hand, hand, it is very bad. Check their GPAs. You know? <laughs> Why was that kid in math class then? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you want to all bear on us? <laughs> Man, I like yeah. to see you guys together. It's a great, it's a man. good combo. I keep yeah. thinking we're both going to go to talk and kiss. Like, yeah. just, I like just, the, the work that rule. The Bruce I Springsteen um, banging hookers and shit, dude. Yeah. That was pretty awesome. Did you ever do that stuff? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> do you ever bang any of the hookers? What? Yeah, You've never, never kissed a hooker. Nah, he, you got friends that you've never open mouth kissed a hooker. No, what's a hooker, dude? Yeah, he's got friends that have done it, but he's never done it. Hooker, I hardly know. That's the that's the main line. You go look. I get doing it. 
It's I, just not for me. Oh, yeah. yeah. I went down there with my guys, but, you know, <laughs> yeah. I didn't participate. Yeah. Say, uh, Anna told me earlier, you're not supposed to say hooker anymore. That's, that's Sex worker. Prostitute anymore. Sex worker, yeah. Sex worker. <laughs> but, but what's wrong with, I get what hooker might sound bad, but what, what's wrong with prostitute? I don't understand what that's about. That's about slut for pay. Yeah. <laughs> also, <laughs> hookers. Is that, I'm just trying to live by the rules. Enterprising <laughs> whore. Yeah. Yeah. I can't say money pig anymore. <laughs> <laughs> also, hooker, hooker's not bad. Reverse cum hooker's ATM. Uh, it was, it's not bad. The reason, the reason it's uh, but it's also not a sex worker. God damn it. It's different. It's like that's an umbrella statement. Are they Strippers bullying actual sexual? hookers? Again, I don't understand why. Who the fuck cares about their rights? <laughs> the fuck. We should, yeah, well, we should a kill a them. Group. I mean, if why can't you say prostitute? If Grand Theft that. Auto taught me anything, it's yeah, that yeah. you can kill them and no stars appear. You know, well, there's I, there's a lot of uh, like educated upper class white ladies who are getting into sex work so oh, yeah. they're yeah. getting into it being like actually we need right it's like dude oh uh, yeah because they're all on yeah, they're changing it yeah because of the only the, that's fans the second uber mm-hmm. job of uh, upper class white I mean, ladies yeah, it is. yeah it is and that's truly what it is it's 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 middle class white ladies getting into something and then saying i don't want to be tagged with this thing that i look down upon well then don't do it you fucking do, money hungry but slut. i want to be able to do the thing i look down upon so it's not cool to call at this anymore. Take it down That's really <laughs> oh, oh, you want to get a mic? Cut that part out, please. Oh, okay. Uh, do you want to, uh, is, do they have one more mic? Again? Would you kiss? Say yeah, try it again. Mind. Take two on that. Take two on that. Blue yeah, blue. take two. My Should bad. I say the whole thing again? No, yeah, no it's okay. okay. My bad. Was it very quiet? No, it's good. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> can, do they have one more mic? Scream. Just scream for somebody. It's a hell of a hey, producer somebody. you have here. <laughs> you know, you know, like Gardini. <laughs> I'm sorry for tone Man, policing Zeros you. Man, is on your ass, Gardini. I'm sorry for tone policing you. I'm on you, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Gardini's he's a roast worried, master. He's just worried he about the product, you. dude. I, I'm joking. He might get you. Watch out. Oh, shit, really? Yeah. yeah. He's How pretty nice. What's your record? Um, seven and two, seven and one. It's fucking good, bro. What, what are your notable Ooh, roast masters? Yeah. Oh. I'm here. Why would I not know them? You gonna let them talk down to you like that, dude? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just got fucking roasted. I just got fucking dude. obliterated. This is literally the room Spider got killed in. This is he it. Said, this is oh, exactly how it happened. Shit, yeah. yeah. He said you don't know fucking entertainment, dude. He goes, nobody you know. <laughs> <laughs> You wouldn't know him, dude. <laughs> Shook. <laughs> Damn, I never would have thought Ari and Gardini would have a beef. Francis, fuck him up. No. <laughs> Francis would wail on Gardini. Look at him. He's going to the cigs. Dude. He's nervous. Oh, I, th- yeah. I think the... Uh, oh, can I have one of those, bro? There we go. Oh. True. Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh. Oh, wait. I fear think- Island. I think they, uh, the like upper middle white class ladies went from burlesque to, to that. Yeah. They saw what they were getting. They're like, we could just suck some dick. Hmm. Burlesque is like the gateway whoredom to yeah. That's actual the marijuana. Of, yeah, that's the marijuana of sex work. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's strip. It's stripping for people with English. There was majors. a, yeah. <laughs> I was reading, there yeah. was, there was a piece that came out about a lot of the women who went to OnlyFans who were then getting like outed and then losing their jobs at like only. Yeah. Yeah, the at losing their jobs at like the non whore jobs. You're yeah, and yeah. then they were like, "I don't know what to do Day now. Jobs. I'm only making you know sixteen thousand dollars a month on OnlyFans," <laughs> and you're like, "Well, that, clearly that was better than your work." Yeah, at you should have you should have committed to it fully anyway. Yeah, now. dive in. They don't have benefits though. No, no, no. Yeah, but, they're they're just oh, punishing themselves <laughs> constantly. Every pretty much everyone on OnlyFans, every porn star, every stripper is is also a fucking prostitute. Yeah. No, yeah. that's not true. <laughs> Pretty much everyone. That's not true. What are you doing later? Every stripper is like, what are you doing? La-? Like, we can talk. That's not yeah, true. Yeah, true. You don't have. It's like I think in like some, <laughs> you, you can make sweeping generalizations like that about, but not about most, that. It's most, most. No, like like Joe for instance, I think, I think it's true if you say like Defends all them. Jews are evil, right. but that's different. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But like, I don't think you can say that about you know what strippers I mean? and hookers. <laughs> <laughs> you actually did do it. You got to be on that one. I didn't know where you were headed for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> he loves it. <laughs> but yeah, no, they all have their price. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the United States. You could bribe the United States government, but you just need like a billion dollars. So, right. Yeah. 
I was in LA. There was a I went to a strip club, and it was uh, they they stopped serving alcohol after like one in the morning what? at the strip clubs. I don't know why. Yeah. And then I got a lap dance from this girl. <laughs> you got cut off. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, what's your name? And then she gave me her name. And then at the end of the night, I was like, well, you know, I'm I'm here for a week. Like, let's hang out. Ooh. She was like, okay. And she gave me. A, a different name, like a, a human name, yeah. and then, um, that's, that's and then we were like name. texting, yeah. And she, and then we texted for like a couple days, and then she gave me an, another third name, yeah. so that she had like layers of uh, of how she wanted to present herself. She was probably gonna rob you with scopolamine or whatever that stuff is. What Maybe is that? Scope. It blow it. Oh, yeah. Just like, yeah. That works. Is that real? Yeah, it's fucking sure. real. Chloroform. Is that shit? People you can die put that from that in front of someone's time. face and they no, they're it's, out it's cold. a powder. You just go, it's like a plant. You go really. Yeah. If you breathe it in, happened you'll to just, a buddy of mine. They were really? fucking Francis. stripped down naked. All his money was gone. Everything no was gone. Way. Yeah, you go yeah, into zombie mode for like three over. hours. Oh my god. Francis is like, Francis is like, she told me your name was Angelica, and then with a J. <laughs> at the end of the night, she's like, my name's Frank. And then after that, she's like, my name's Bobby. Damn. He's like, can we go back to Angelica? <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm a stripper now. I got to come back and work as a bouncer in 40 minutes. <laughs> Damn, Francis, you probably fuck hard. Don't you partied, you? bro. Yeah. You, he's yeah, like dude. fit. Francis, Francis the you probably. Are behind me. You don't fuck days. hard? You know, I I, I, I had Punisher? my fun. I you had got my a penis, fun. don't you? You have a bigger penis. Francis, you know, it's fine. Look at him. He's a specimen. For sure. Dude, yeah. take it out. For sure. Slap yeah. it on the table. Yeah. Would you well, show your penis? No. No. He's got the, he's got the dick. fucking Cobra Kai face, bro. Dude, you probably <laughs> big dick. Did you? Don't do Let that. me ask you. I'll try to put this. I'll ask you. I, you. I have a question for you. When you were playing like high school or college sports, and the guys were like, uh, you know, you'd shower. Were there guys on your team who would like work it up a little before they came into? Yeah, the I don't even know any of those guys. <laughs> guys who would like who maybe would pull on it before. Yeah, it. Get, get what are you talking there, about? You know, yeah, I do that there. before the doctor. Yeah, dude. Do you really? I watched porn in the lobby. Yeah, hell yeah! Hell you can't yeah. present your boy. You can't show your boys a small dick. So you, yeah. you, yeah. I would sometimes accidentally go too hard. And- that's it. <laughs> yeah, that's it. You got it's. It's a thin line. True. You're, you're like, oh, calm down. You know, true. Yeah, it's distressing. You now you can't be too hard for your boys. No, no. But no. you can't definitely. You certainly hard. can't be soft. True. If you're showing your boys your penis, you definitely have a semi. You have should. some respect for them. You know? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Dude, there was one kid on the team have who everyone, everyone thought had a big dick, but I was like, you can see the veins. Like, it's it's engorged. You know what I mean? Like, yes. you knew that he was. And this was the lacrosse or? Uh, this was, yeah, lacrosse. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That must, that, yeah, you guys probably got some decent dongs in there. Lacrosse? Some. Lacrosse guys some. fuck. Yeah. I'm not even talking about that fucking Duke show. I mean, like, normally. They fuck. Yeah. <laughs> it's outside consensual, you know but they team, go hard. You know what, team, yeah. like, lacrosse, and also, to like, rowing guys. Like, really? I, I swear to God, like. Because they're butt fucking the whole time. <laughs> and then the other guy's like, oh shit. And then he pushed harder. It's, 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 it's time. Yeah. I don't think it's fueled. I didn't know this until yeah. I started comedy. Yeah, like, I back. started to meet dudes that went to Penn that were rowing guys. Mm, and, yeah. like, those guys crushed so much fucking ass. And then you were down there, like, <laughs> like fucking there. Plinko like, at yeah, the I bottom. Like, I was like, let me plump you up before you go in front of your boys naked, dude. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I would have. Yeah, yeah. I would have taken it. But no, a lot seriously, of- dude. Like, I, like, rowing guys, like, they would, like, it was insane. It was insane in Philly. The they have big guys. dicks. Why did you have so much crossover with rowing people? Because rowing True. was because rowing was big in Philly. Just down by the docks, the, yeah. the river, the the boathouses. There's like yeah. seven right it on was, top it of was, each yeah, other. Yeah, it was a huge oh, yeah, thing in, in Philly. The boathouses, yeah. and I never knew that when I was a kid. We, you, you know, you drive by the boathouses and they had Christmas lights on them. And yeah, it's nice. That oh, that's cute. That's that the Christmas houses. Yeah. In summertime, you can smell the pussy. And started to hang out in Philly. I was like, oh, those. That's where the rowing guys go. Yeah, and every. One of them always had like chicks, and like mm-hmm. it was uh, mm-hmm. it was a scene. Well, the Winklevoss twins were both big time rowers, really. Yeah. And they, I, yeah, I mean, <clears throat> I, I I was after them, but yep. they they hooked up with the hottest yep. girls. Ever. Did you ever see the Little Rascals? Yep, worked then too. Yeah, <laughs> took her out on the lake. Yeah, well, that was oh yeah, it was a rowboat. That wasn't quite the TV show crew the movie. 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 Oh, oh what oh, would okay. you call a crew boat? Uh, a, I don't know what you'd call I would imagine it. Imagine a rowboat, a galley. No. No, like an eight-person narrow yeah, rowing what, boat. It was just yeah. kind of a rowboat, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh no, a rowboat is when you have both of them and you're going out to a bigger boat to a lighthouse. What's the kind where they got from like Fiji to Hawaii and they got that one little sideboard? Yeah, yeah, up? yeah. An ocean. Sk- I, feel, I feel like nautical knowledge is like a measure of whiteness. Yeah. Is it? The more you know about nautical I terms, agree. the whiter. Not yeah. a lot of black rowers. No. What's up? I don't see that. 
Yeah, where's the fucking rowing commercial trying to get diversity? Mm-hmm. True. Mm-hmm. Good point. Fuck late night. <laughs> True that. Yeah. Makes you think. <laughs> it does. It does. It Cut does. that part off, please. <laughs> yeah, well. That's Dude, what else is up, man? Chilling, bro. Oh, yeah. Chilling. I, yeah, this is this is ideal. This Just is the awesome. fellas, dude. Did you drive up for this? Yeah. Yeah. You did? Yeah. yeah. Damn. It's awesome. Yeah, I'm only two hours time. away. Yeah, I guess so. Richard? Philly. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Normally we record there. I usually what part of Philly go there. Is? Art Museum. Nice, dude. Mm-hmm. I like it down there. Yeah. Man. That's yeah. right near the boathouse. Exactly. Isn't it? Kind of, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah man. I'm I'm walk by all the time. About Philly. Nice. I, I was driving through the city like a week or two ago, and they seem to have redone all of the roads. The whole mm. city is completely modernized. What are you talking about? I'm, dude, I'm telling you, every <laughs> street that I saw, roads on dude, Earth. I'm telling you, yeah. every street I saw was brand new paved. They probably just really? paved the street where you were. It was a <laughs> lot of streets, <laughs> and You're it was smooth. Center city, by yeah. yeah, yeah. They probably just I paved the street. Philly, like it was, because I grew up outside of Philly, and I started comedy in Philly. Philly overnight became. I mean, there there are sections of Philly where you would go down, and you'd be like. Did they just shoot the opening scene of Rocky here? <laughs> like it was like desolate. It was hard. And overnight, it was like the hippest place on yeah. fucking planet Earth. Like I don't know what happened. No, it's still there's still parts that like they're the murder rate's flying right now. Oh really? Uh, mm. Like I mean, murder city. The they're right? breaking records. Yeah, they're breaking it's records bad. right now. Thirty three percent up from last year. There Damn, was, that's there was high. Just, that's a fucking. That's, and they that's hit five hundred. Like they hit five hundred last year. Five hundred percent. Five hundred. Five hundred deaths. Yes. yes. Yeah. And now dude, they're dude. up thirty three percent from that. Normally they're around. I just looked at it last week. I was, mm. I've been talking about it for a week. Five hundred a year. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, there was a six-person shootout near my old house on 37th and Mellon. Nice. Yeah. It was the OK Corral. That's, that's what Spud that's was exactly saying. exactly what that was. That's what Spud was saying. He said it was like an old Western dude, six dudes just shooting it out. What do you think they were saying? Do you think they did a draw? <laughs> yeah, for but, sure. <laughs> you think there's some mentals? It's, it's nuts. Fucking... <laughs> it's nuts because when I, started, when I started comedy in Philly, my opening joke used to be, Philly, where's, where's the good part? And it would get this huge fucking laugh. And now it's not like, I mean, there's still stuff happening, but like, no, like Fishtown, like, Fish Town, for example, Fishtown Fish used nice. to be a disaster. And it now is. it's like, it you still go there is, and it's, it's worse. It's like there's coffee shops and all I love stuff. when a it's local government strange. is just makes a decision. Like we're making that nice. Now they kick all the homeless and the fucking, they're just like, we're making it nice. They build a boardwalk or something. Yep. And mm. it's just like within two years. Yeah. Mm. They move them in Orange County. They, uh, you can't be homeless. They'll pick you up and drop you off. Orange County, California, California. Yeah. Wow. If you're homeless in Orange County, they'll pick you up and just drop you drive off. Drive you to Baco. Pretty much, yeah. It's yeah. outside the limits and just be like, get out of here, dude. Like Rambo. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Keep walking. Yeah. <laughs> Do you guys ever think about if if you were to watch something unfold, like a uh, someone like homeless or person? something is about to like attack a, 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 a an elderly nice person? What's the guy look like? The homeless guy. You know. Good you know. Guy. You know. So homeless. I, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Dirty. Okay. Um. It's hard. W- would you step in? Fuck no. no. Yeah, hell yeah, dude. I'd kill him. You could, which one? I'd the home, end his sorry life. The homeless oh. guy. No, you would not. <laughs> oh, hold on. I got a good one. I was walking right in Chinatown. I was walking past this. Uh, I was walking into a shop yeah. to get some water, and there was Brave a you. homeless lady just clearly dead. Yeah. What? Like a black lady on the ground, like clearly ODing. And I like stared at her for a second. I was like, all right, I'm just going to go into this shop. Yeah. And then when I came out, people were like helping her and I had to stop and be like, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> like I, thought, I was like, oh like should God. I help? And they were like, no, we're okay. I was like, okay, good luck. Oh, God, thank God. Yeah. Yeah. I watched her dying and I was just like, hey, damn, I gotta I'm, go. I gotta, I'm late for dinner. I got to get this water. <laughs> <laughs> I well, saw a dude on a bike, get a fucking courier or like a delivery guy get hit by a car going through a red light, flipped and fucking fell. And I jumped off my bike. I called 911. And then they came pretty fast. And yeah. then like, uh, and then I was like, "Fuck!" And I went and put my bike off to the side, and I was like, "And then they, and I was like, how's he doing?" And the guy, the ambulance driver, was like, "Who are you?" I'm like, "I'm the guy who called." The hero. Called. Hello. He goes, yeah. We're good. Thanks. Damn. Uh, yeah. Dude, fucking respect. That yeah. must happen all the time, though. Here, She'd be like, where's the news? It, are they gonna interview me in New York? Yeah. It must, dude. Every single time that somebody gets hit or something, there must be. 12 white people like what's going on here (laughs) what are you guys following the rules i gotta say i gotta say about ari it's like it's like people will never expect it because he makes like insanely crass jokes on instagram and 
and he's he's a very edgy guy. He's and a he, jerk. He's, yeah, he says outlandish shit. He's the first guy, honestly, and I've been with him in situations in public where somebody needs help. He's the first guy to be like, "Are you okay? Do you need help?" Yeah, like, I try to keep it quiet. He my really, truly is like a humanitarian. Mm -hmm. Like honestly, sick, and then my Patreon's all like kindness and stuff. Yeah, so I'm honestly, yeah. Seriously, I mean, look yeah. at this. He I'm came. Not, he came I'm with being, gifts. I'm not being yeah, funny. I'm serious. Oh, yeah, I cut that part out when I gave him. My You're not being a funny guy. <laughs> but he came. He came and gave us yeah, gifts. Yeah, man. No, he's he's a sweet he, guy. He's I, I've seen him out in public where like somebody's in like a, a little bit of a bind. He's like, are you OK? Like, you mm. know, like it's mm. gets funny. involved. He sticks his nose yeah. in people's it's, fucking business. Well, he can't help it. There's no. That fucking beak. Just talked him alone. I'm clearly more. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Well, I, I I've been thinking a lot. <laughs> Look at this, dude. He's a Francis machine. He's a fucking a, machine. Oh, yeah. guess it's going, dude. I, the, I've been thinking a lot that um, you know, to to intervene, mm -hmm. especially given how many people are are picking up phones and taping right. altercations. I had that thought with the lady. You just Outside, all you I need. Like, I don't need to call one. the cops. You just Someone need you need one yeah. <laughs> moment where you're the guy on camera. Like bending down and and breaking it up, or 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 for me, the one I really want. What what, do you, what, what situation are you? Talking oh, you about? want to say this is the that. one I want. This yeah. is the one I think about a lot. Someone, a, a homeless person pushes. You want to beat the hell a nice, out of a homeless, like elderly Asian woman into yeah. the tracks of the subway, and then I the, the train's coming, but there's enough time where I jump down and I sort of cover her and push her into the trough. Yeah, yeah. and we oh, and we oh. and the train comes See, over us. And then we scramble out, and I'm like, we're all good here. And by that point, everyone's filming. Yeah, and then when you punch that homeless guy, that's when the thing is going to start. And they're like, who's this fucking asshole? Yeah. Yeah. They'll, they'll, just, they'll just edit it into you like sexually assaulting an old Asian yeah, woman. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. Right. Or the track. It's not worth here's it. how you, here's no, how you, here's how nice. you carry that out perfectly. After you save the lady from the tracks, mm -hmm. you come up, and everybody goes, look at this homeless guy that pushed her in there. And you go, stop. And you give the guy a sandwich. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You love sandwiches. Uh, Joey Rhodes' sandwich. That's yes, what you, that's what you do. And then you, then everybody's like, "Oh my god, that, look, this guy is." It's your next no bounds. Yeah, you that's know, your next yeah. commercial. Oh, actually, that's yeah. gonna be your yeah. first. Yeah, you want to do it? Let's shoot it. I'm down. Yeah, right. I've, I've been I'll dealing be with guy. crippling anxiety, and I, uh, <laughs> I'll push a I'm a Latina, second generation. <laughs> well, cuantos años tienes? Here, have a sandwich. You know? <laughs> yeah. 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 All right. Yeah, I like that. It's good to hear a fantasy. I have a bunch of those. My favorite. Uh, I gave you one of my favorites. I have one more, if you don't mind. Oh yeah, please. No, the other know. one is active shooter situation Definitely. developing food court of a, of a mall. Nice. I'm on the second floor of the atrium. Right, it's a big open space. I'm crunching down some like Auntie Aunt Anne's pretzel bites or something. Are you at the court? Yeah, but I'm up above. I'm above. He's so above, I, like I Batman. see. He's got a, oh, so you're outlook. perched. Yeah, the yeah. guy they come in yeah. wearing, you know, fucking paintball gear or whatever, yeah. and and he's got all kinds of 3D printed guns, and I, I, I flying squirrel off and and land on him and crumple. Him. Oh, from above. Yeah, <laughs> telescope is fine. Like maybe he yeah. fires off <laughs> a, <laughs> yeah, a few a few rounds get out, but uh, you know, no, maybe one guy gets hit in the calf or something. Winged, yeah. And and I land on him and I telescope his spine. He's paralyzed, maybe dead. And uh, and 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 maybe I like you, you got to get a little injured, right? Yeah. So, see, so like a sprained wrist. So you're wearing a cast. Yeah. For the president, we should also unbolt his guns, like pop the clips out and be like, a <sighs> yeah, really I don't know how to do that. Yeah, like that. I don't know. <laughs> you're gonna want you're gonna want a couple people to die first, because otherwise, True. you think? Yeah, yeah, it won't really yeah, make so it's it's it could yeah. have been a lot worse. Yeah, yeah. 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 right, 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 right. right. Yeah. Here's my impression of Shane in the same situation. The guy's down there, he starts firing. Shane's like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, definitely. Yeah. No, no, yeah. No, no, no. They're picking up yeah. some of the victims' food yeah. that they left. Exactly. Yeah. Is that guy, what you, yeah, yeah. Are you okay? Yeah. Are you eating that? Yeah. Is that, that, is that a tag, tag humor? You got to fish that. <laughs> Oh, no, Joe, you want to get in on this and make jokes about me? Yes. No, no, no. Not about you. You say you do that, though. Shooter comes into the Walmart, whatever it is, right? You jump out. Boom, boom, boom. You take five shots that were meant for Chess. five other people, right? Set. And as you're bleeding out in pain, and people are booing a shooter, you just you just you just arm the shooter, and you just go. It's not his fault. It's not his fault. He had a tough life. And then, but then you're dead. You would be the greatest if you go. It's not his fault. 
he had a tough life and people would be like i don't even know how to handle this kind yeah right now. i got one i got one that you guys probably also have the fantasy where it's like yeah. you're at a diner there's like a table of black guys they're talking too loud you yeah. stand up and just fucking start wailing <laughs> on like them. That one. Yeah, yeah, you can get some. Sick, you know? get some heat well, how about this? One? How about this one? Somebody comes in shooting, and then you just pass the ball to a fucking autistic kid. He just rains threes. Yeah. You know that's gonna get a lot of hits. He just fucking nailing threes, dude. Those autistic kids can shoot. Actually, the way you can do it is. I was hot as a pistol that day. <laughs> the way you can do it is is yeah. you disarm the shooter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You disarm the shooter and save everybody, and everybody goes, "You're a hero," and you go, "No, I'm not. This kid is." And then you hand the the glory to an autistic kid or something. That's how you, and you do go, it. This kid's a hero, mm -hmm. yeah. and everybody cheers that kid. Yeah. And then and you just kind of walk off. Then you're good, dude. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You walk yeah. off. Yeah. yeah. Damn. And then you extort the kid for money. <laughs> <laughs> and then you just get online and cyber cyber bully him into a into a shooting of his own. <laughs> we, we, we should probably wrap this thing up, right? What are we looking like? Yeah. Hour nineteen. Hour seven. But you okay. got, you, you got a lot of cuts to make there. Oh yeah, never mind. Let's What's fuck up? it. Keep it rolling. Oh time. yeah, we had a little bit of a. We need a sandwich after sure. this. Would you make one? Come on, no, Joe. Dude. Please. What? Pop it up. We'll pay you money. Pop it up. Yeah, we're gonna cut whoa, my whoa, whoa, whoa. Right now, Negotiate. We're going to show your cards. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> Joe. Be a friend. That's all right. That means I bet the sandwiches will be better. Ooh, oh, yeah. Drinking a love. little, you'll be like, I'm going to take some chances on Get these. That Shabbos mm. spice. <laughs> you make a nice Italian. Nice yeah. Italian. Yeah. What's the one it's with the cherry? Hard. With the cherry, the cherry peppers like they have in Philadelphia mm -hmm. on, the, on those. The Easty. I, I don't Anna like the names. Easty today. She flipped. So Joe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she flipped. Joe, I know you don't want to hear this. You're trying not to look at me. Then the names are gay though. Huh? <laughs> the names of your sandwiches are gay. I don't use gay as an adjective like that, dude. So I don't That's know what you're talking about. How would you about. describe gay? What do you use gay for, like, not sandwiches? Nouns? Happy. Are you like, look at that, gay? Oh. I use it for happy. That'd be great to start using gay as happy. Noun. How people That's still what it be means. mad at you. Gay means happy. Try that in public. Whoa. Try that when you go on the fucking Tonight Show. Like, we're having such a gay time here. Let's <laughs> see how far it gets you. All right. Yeah. I will. Yeah. I will. Jimmy Fallon's a good dude, man. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Why do you say that? What's the joke there? Just to be like, you're calling Jimmy. He's like, he's gay. Be like, Jimmy found you're gay. I've always thought you're gay as you're fuck. You're so gay, That's dude. Your, I watch yeah. the show all the time. You're fucking gay. <laughs> and he's like, hey, don't curse. I'm like, you're right. Look how gay you are, keeping it about and not cursing. Yeah. To include everybody. Jimmy Fallon's gay. What a great fucking title for this fucking episode. Yeah, there we go. Jimmy Fallon's gay. So gay. <laughs> uh, we don't need that. I always thought you were incredibly gay. I heard he's very nice. Yeah, most gay guys are. Oh, he's boozing. <laughs> True. Yeah. <laughs> he's he's been boozing. I think he drinks a little. Oh, really? He, yeah, yeah, I think he loves it. A I think he drinks well. I drank with him before. Really? Yeah. I'm not kidding. I drank with him. Does he drink box wine? <laughs> I don't remember what he was drinking. He got slap in the we bag. Got real <laughs> fucked up. Really? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Did you guys Maybe he roofied you. Uh, he was cool, but he was like, he definitely gets a little, he definitely got a little Hansy. like, a little palsy. He definitely got a little like, foggy. Whoa. Foggy. Fallon was touching was you fun, and pushing you. He was, was pulling fun. your pigtails. Yeah, we had fun. Yeah. <laughs> it was fun. I, I loved it. I had a great time. Did you guys, tell you the one joke I remember Jimmy Fallon doing, popping into the store before he was a Tonight Show. He was like early SNL and he came with Sobel and he was like, uh, there's one joke he did that I remember. And he goes, uh, yeah, so I, I try to pump my gas. And I put $20 in and it goes like 19, 1990, 1991, 1992, 1993. So then when I pay, I go, here's 1991. Here's 1992. That was it. Classic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then he, got, and then he put his hands thing. on Joe and he titty. <laughs> Joe, did he go up on you? No, no. I'm telling you, he was cool. He was cool. He, was he, was like just rough, he likes to rough house a little. No, he wasn't rough house. I mean, like, we got shit faced and he just kind of kept me in like, Fuggy. You got nice yeah. eyes. Like, it was, like, it was yeah. that kind of actually. It was exactly like drinking with Shane. <laughs> <laughs> it was the same thing. Uh, what? Uh, like yeah, it was the same thing. It was what you do when you drink. What's I was that? Like, I like this guy. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, that truly life. Today's episode is brought to you by Truly. Everybody, if you're <laughs> looking to get drunk and yeah, no, keep I it like gay, it's nice Truly. Guy. Seems cool. I heard he's very nice to people. Yeah. Yeah, we had we had a good time. We had a good time. Hmm. Pretty good time. Already. Are, are, are Already, you tell that joke again? Yeah, the 1991. Yeah. No, it's fucking Fallon's joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like when he impersonates Neil Young. That's, that's something I take offense yeah. to. I never saw that. That's, I've been calling. It's pretty, it's pretty offensive. I've been calling honest. Billy with some Neil Youngs. Really? Because Matt's brother Bill, we make fun of him for being gay. Yeah. Who's he's my fuck Bill? My, Matt's my brother. brother. He's oh, hilarious. Yeah. He's big. He's pretty jacked. But I, I like to call him because he drives a truck, mm -hmm. so he's, he you always answers. So I'll call him and do it. Like, 
Neil Young. I got a nice Neil Young going. What about just fucking him. <laughs> Wait, what? Hold on. I forget. I forget what it was. But it's I just like Neil what's Young when you remember. what tune is it? I'll set suck to? on Bill's dick. <laughs> I'll fuck his asshole. <laughs> Something like that. Is it set to the tune of Old Man? That's and then there's that one too. Oh. Thanks. That's a great Neil Young. Give it a shot. Yeah. You can do it. No, it's easy. Yeah. It's so easy. That's a great Neil Young. Dude. It's one of the easiest ones. <laughs> yeah, that's her real. Nobody does it. Give me another bar. Give me another bar. Hold on. I've been in Bill's ass. <laughs> I sucked on his dick. <laughs> oh my God, I've so been a true. minor in Bill's asshole. <laughs> that was pretty easy. <laughs> Fuck. And he loves it. He gets a kick That's out a of it. That's a really good day. Hey. Seriously. Oh, man. I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's real. It's fun to do. Call, <laughs> call him Bill and singing gay stuff. You're making him. a trucker's day, dude. That's it. Ain't a trucker with some gay Neil Young on the road, dude. And he's like, I'm, I ain't gay. Yeah. <laughs> he gets, it's yeah, the best it part. works for the song, dude. Yeah. Yeah. We're all with it, Bill. Yeah, come on, Bill. You like yeah, gay man. stuff? Yeah. yeah. Can you do a Neil? You can do a Neil Young. You know, no, definitely no, can. You good at so. impressions? Well, I heard that Australian earlier. That was awesome. That was a yeah. great Australian. Yeah, it's generous. No, the only one I ever had was. Was uh, Owen Wilson, but everyone, it's Whoa. such an easy one to do. Let's hear, wow. let's hear Owen Wilson f- c- completing the suicide. Uh, completing yeah. the suicide? No. Yeah. He tried to kill himself? Yeah, wasn't that Owen Wilson? Yeah, yeah. Owen Wilson awesome. did. When? Um, yeah. Yeah. Right after yeah. Wedding, <laughs> wedding Crashers? Yeah. The role was too dark, dude. It was right before Wedding Crashers. Oh, wow. Wedding Crashers was part of his, like, that was his rebound. Yeah, because he goes, yeah, he was like, I'm reading Don't Kill Myself books. And, I mean, if I'm, if I'm going to do it, it's going to be in, like, a place like Maui or a Wahoo. Yeah, it's what good. Happened, good. What happened to yeah, Great yeah, yeah. Awesome. How did he try to kill himself? Yeah, that's First great. of all, me and Homeboy here, we need to sort some stuff out. It's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good. That's, that's great. Good, uh, awesome. That's all right. How did he try to kill himself? <laughs> I don't know. That's a good question. You look that up? Yeah, can we see? I'm reading Don't Kill Myself. Please. What? Oh, deep. Oh, so, he, oh, so he was no, having fun. Did yeah. He sleep, did he do something like that? No, you're yeah. thinking of his brother in the Royal Tenenbaum. They both. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's true. That's the movie. Oh, that's Owen right. To, it was a risk thing. Yeah. Listen, Owen's always trying to be like Luke, so. True. Really? Luke is my favorite wow. on the Wilson. He's done nothing with his life. I, no, he's so Luke? good. Yeah. He's only does his indie Tito films, Jackson and he's up. so good at being like a quietly frustrated man. Like mm. he's so great in every movie. Luke is so good. Wait, why? How, yeah, how Luke's done old, old, school, old school, old school, old school, and idiocracy are great. And you know yeah. what else was pretty good? That that horror film, Vacancy. I take it back. Wait, yeah. hold on. How did he try to kill himself? Remember that movie? <laughs> yeah, Vacancy was pretty solid. Huh? He did both. He slid his wrist and took pills. Yeah, took a bunch of pills. Damn. Okay. Oh, that's Jesus. the guy who wanted to do it. There's no like, Damn. Uh, you know, he got party. Maybe he partied. What kind of pills? Is, yeah, true. What kind of pills? <laughs> what kind of pills? Viagra's. <laughs> <laughs> maybe it's the kind that make you cut your wrist. Maybe he was just on something. Yeah, maybe he was on one, bro. He boner himself to death. He's just <laughs> <laughs> can't find it. Joe, you crazy. They probably that. didn't say. Uh, yeah, I'm crazy. Why did they try again? <laughs> I, I would think why those guys don't try again. If you took Viagra. It would definitely, and then you cut your wrist. It would, it would. Blood would be pumping. Blood blood would be pumping out. Honestly, if you took too much Viagra, I think you would have a heart attack. I'm serious. Yeah, yeah. you have to cut your dick and let yeah, you bleed out that way. You have a heart attack, I think. Mm. Yeah. yeah, well, I think, yeah, I think if you, they say if you get, like, I think it's called a preaprism when, like, your boner won't go down, they yeah. tell you to slit your wrist if you're if you're in dire straits. <laughs> Just, you kidding? No, I'm kidding. No. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I, I, it's a good word to, 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 to sell that way. Slit your wrist. It's called Just a preaprism. Yeah, just yeah. to do the pleasure, just, or the, uh, the pressure. Well, yeah, you're not going to run into that problem, Joe. I got no dick. What? I saw your dick today in the bathroom. You saw his penis in there? How was it? Chase, <laughs> it was all right. I could see you Pretty having a floppy. good penis. Oh, I can see you having a big hog, floppy. Dude. Yeah, yeah. He didn't work it up. He's kind of like shoving it, it back. Looks like it would be like very soft, but still floppy. Yeah, I was fingering yeah. the hole and shoving it back up into my pussy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Because <laughs> Kazari came in. Right? It was a nice head for sure. The head it was mostly head, like a I tip, saw. like a nice fat you tip. Do, do you have to splint it in? Do you create the the finger splint and feed it? I cut Talking it about big dust, big dick stuff. Yeah, like uh, I split it open and let the pee fall out. You know what I have to do to make my dick go in? What? what? <laughs> lean forward. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, lean forward. I was just making a dick joke. Oh. Yeah. 
You guys talking about big dick stuff? We're talking yeah, about little dick stuff. Got a flop job, dude. Yeah, oh, I got a fucking hog, dude. dude. It's uncomfortable. <laughs> really? Yeah, it's a problem. Does it change things between you and people when they find out about it? Or? Yeah, dudes have a problem with me more, so I try to like keep it under wraps. Cut this part out, and then. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> And then chicks, you know, they won't leave me alone. It's yeah. Annoying. How big is your penis? It's not about that. It's more about mass and like power. It really is. <laughs> big, dude. He's got a big dick. Yeah. <laughs> or he's got a cock in the truest sense of the word. He's a coxman. Yeah, yeah he's got a cock. You know I'd like to downplay it, but it's like, you know. Yeah. It's, it's Jordan. How, you go to basketball? You can't be like, yeah, I'm all right. But like, stop. You're one of the yeah, best you're ever. Good. You know? Mm -hmm. Lamont Jordan is a buddy of mine. Played over at uh, the park in whatever with some kids he was like you know pretty much Francis how do you feel about being in second place in the dick contest <sighs> you downplayed yours that's the only reason I upplayed mine <laughs> I, I feel good I feel good about my chances yeah. I feel like you got a nice hog on that's you what I friends. said yeah. Yeah, I would think sure. so what's your tuft like though is it red uh, yeah, we're only on. Yeah. Whoa. Scott is king. Big on a red. Of course it is, dude. His tuft red looks pubes. like fucking Little Orphan Annie's fucking afro, uh, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look like Ron Weasley's goatee. Yeah. yeah. His tuft is singing Hard Knock Life, bro. Mm -hmm. Weird. <laughs> People always yeah. ask me that. They're like, does the, the carpet match the drapes? That's the thing. That's what they say. Yeah. I'm like, now, well, why, what, who has drapes or carpet? I, well, where are we talking about here? Francis, I don't say this. I, I swear to God, I'm not saying this to bust your balls. It are are ginger I wouldn't even call you ginger. You're almost a blonde. Strawberry yeah, blonde. Strawberry blonde. Are your pubes almost translucent? I feel like when you yeah. get down to the pubes on with a hair color like yours, they're almost like see through or reflective. Like no, fishing, like fishing string. If you it's, rustle them at yes, night, do they yes, shine? Fishing, yes. Yeah, like fishing it's, string. It's phosphorescent. Uh, no, they, they, uh, <laughs> it's, like, <laughs> it's like diving under a wave in, a, in an algae bloom. You know? Yeah, you see. Yeah, <laughs> it's all. It's a, well. Yes, right. Yeah, like a firefly. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, you catch them in a jar and you bring them home and you're like, oh, they'll they twinkle tomorrow. Yeah. They twinkle. No, they're uh, it's 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 redder here than than here. Really? Yeah, wow. because these don't get sunlight. Can I get a good look? You can yeah, show me your bush. I'm, I'm, sure bush. I'm pretty trim right now. Let me take a gander. Let me see, oh, I see that show bush. Your pals and pubes. See that Nothing. bush? Ew, Francis. Ew, 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 ew dude. Don't show me. Show your dick. Ew, bring it in pretty. I brought it in pretty tight recently. I thought I was gonna have sex today. Then you, I thought I was gonna have sex with my girlfriend today. Francis is bald. Dude, his body has no pubes. I just he has a little bit of chest hair too. It ends right where. Francis had a landing strip. Ew, Francis, <laughs> you know, Shane, yeah, dude. you look Remember really the, gross. Remember you the Itell ridiculous. joke? Ridiculous. Remember the Itell joke? <laughs> the Itell joke when he, he would talk to, <laughs> there's a redhead walking through the crowd of the cellar and he goes, excuse me, miss. And she goes, yeah. And he goes, how long do we need to date before you felt comfortable with me calling you clown pussy? <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I'm just eating upstairs. Like, I told me I had to go to the bathroom this way. God. Hey, God so fucking you jarred, dude. That jarred say, me. He would do it again where we would say fire bush. Yeah, on our way back out. Between clown pussy and fire yeah. bush. Hmm. It was so funny. Dude, Francis' dick root was crazy. You out of here? Oh, he's getting another. Oh, my yeah, God. Oh, he's got that fucking. Here we go. Dick V, dude. Mm. You saw that? Yeah, dude. It was uncomfortable. Yeah, it was yeah. crazy. Was no hair Knock it off, Francis. Yeah, what's your Don't pubes? get mad at the bull for giving you the horns when you shouldn't have been in the ring in the first place. <laughs> nah, right? you know. <laughs> That's a good metaphor. So I think in that True. is Give that. The, the, the pubes are the horns. He's the bull. <laughs> You guys got in the ring. You we got in the ring. Got but there was levels. no horns. No. There, there were no, no horns. horns. Yeah, don't get mad at the bull for just having a fucking, trim down. Just a sleek torso. Oh. Oh, yeah. oh, that was too sleek. Yeah, yeah it, was it, was, wild, it was arousing for Did us. Did you shave up? No, I go with the grain, but at some point, when you get to the base, you got you to gotta come from the other side. Yeah. Do you shave your balls, too? Yeah, yeah, it's yes or no, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. a tough one to get to, though. Was... Look, when you have orange pubic hair, <laughs> listen to me. People describe orange hair as a, as a shock of red hair. Yeah. If you had hair that was le legitimately described as a mm -hmm. shock to yeah. people, you would do what you could to and they're straight too, aren't they? mitigate it. They're straight. Red yeah, hair are totally straight. I'm not Ari, are you kidding me? Straight hairs. <laughs> oh, yeah, they're straight hairs. Joke. Okay. Nice. Um, Francis, my bigger question is, what happened after you killed the elders in your town? <laughs> 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 I mean, 
<laughs> Destroy him. Destroy him. <laughs> I don't even get, get it, him, but I laugh because I wanted to show to the court. But you look like Malachi. <laughs> yeah. These are older references. You're an old man. Yes, Francis. <laughs> yeah, Francis. Francis so the king of a reference of a movie that you might have heard of. Well, you all laughed at it, you fucking cunts. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, it's really pretty funny. funny on all our parts. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Damn, real Happy. harsh stops. Yeah, man. Well, I like it. Harsh stops. Just harsh hang, stops. It's just hangout time. time. Yeah. It's good hang, bro. Mm. Yeah. Good yeah. episode. Do episode four seventy. Not no. bad. You guys don't want to do a shot together? Yeah, of what? Strawberry liqueur. Oh, tequila. Oh. Well, you can do whiskey if you want. I said strawberry liqueur. Yeah. All right, mm-hmm. strawberry liqueur. Are you guys all some board? Shows? Washington. Yeah, I'll do a shot of tequila. Can we do a shot of tequila? Yeah. You know, Matt. Did, you don't have to. I don't. Care. Matt's not hey, much. Hey, while you're out there, can you get one of those sandwiches? No. <laughs> no, they can't have the sandwiches. Why can't we have the sandwiches? They can't have the sandwiches. What's with you and fucking? Why don't you? Sandwiches? Is there any? Do you throw them out if you don't have any left over? Do you give? Yeah. Them is it like? Food? Is it like vaccines? We have to chuck them in the garbage because <laughs> it's a fear of letting people have them. I gotta come clean with you guys. Yeah. There were never any sandwiches. <laughs> what? It's just a thing we've been saying to people. No. We have no that. sandwiches. No, no I've seen them. Bullshit. There's Bullshit. no way you came up with all those gay names for a joke. Huh? The Easty. This is the, yeah. the Southie. Shane, the Shane Gillis. That'd be nice. <laughs> and finally, now some good ideas. <laughs> some, where was that? <laughs> Dude, Shane, can you do a sketch where you do where you do uh, 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 dating on the spectrum and just you just act we completely like that. yourself? Yes, uh, that's exactly you the, and Kyla. You just Kyla be that, you be you. Dude, with we that talked. Face. We talked about me going on the Australian Love on the Spectrum and being like, Hi. my friend signed me up for it. I'm like, I don't know why I'm on this thing. <laughs> and then they're like, you want to play Twitch while we're waiting for our food? I'm like, yeah. <laughs> like every single thing they're like, you want to look at dinosaurs? Good. I'm like, yeah, I love dinosaurs. <laughs> What's Love on the Spectrum? It's a, uh, it's the best show ever. Yeah. Well, it's number two. There it turns out there's a better one. All right, so this one is. Love it. The number one show is called The Specials, and it's about a house full of people with Down syndrome mm-hmm. in England. They're partying. They're having fun. Yeah, okay. Number two is uh, Love on the Spectrum. It's on Netflix. It's about Australians with autism dating each other Trying in to. front of cameras. Okay. And it's great. And somebody submitted you for this, you're saying? No, that would have been yeah. the joke, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Someone didn't actually submit me but, for it. No, no, but I'm <laughs> saying like... That's the rub. So you were like, no, I wouldn't do that, and then you were like, I'll play Twitch. While we yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. All right, I got you. I'm yeah, just slowly it. realize that... It you know, rules. We all know, unite on... You should do that. Thing. There was one a reality show that came out about, about deaf people during, um, sort of dating and stuff. Did you see that one? No, that sounds funny. It's like Deaf You, I think it was called. <laughs> it's Deaf People Fucking. It was called Shut the Fuck Up. <laughs> Cut that part out, please. <laughs> please remove. <laughs> please remove that. Yeah. So they're deaf and dating. There was a there was, was a cool. college. It was cool. They're all they're signing everything, and it's uh you know it's and fascinating. There was, there was one orgasms. guy who was only half deaf, and so oh. everyone else would be giving their interviews or whatever, and they would be signing, and then there'd be subtitles, and then this guy would would speak as if to yeah. flex that he was not completely hearing impaired. What does half deaf mean? It's like, I was talking this. You'd go and be like, I'm fully, not, I'm not one of you fucking like, yeah, retarded yeah, yeah. pussies. There you go. I'm yeah. here to get ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, sound of metal. Damn, Adele. I'm trying. You You're got right. pickleback chasers? No, I don't. Come on! Damn. This is a mistake. <laughs> I'm not pouring myself a chaser. I just was thirsty or whatever. I'm going to pour myself a chaser. She brought chasers. Oh, nice. Oh, really? Yeah, you can see. Thank you, Matthew. No problem, bro. Thanks. Wow, the stand rules. This is um, is the the most Ari has ever acknowledged my existence. This. Oh, he has to. This This won't happen again. Go back to America. Let's toast Adele. Greatest, absolutely. Stop it! Greatest comedy club manager of all time. That's it. And the stand, greatest comedy club of all time. And this podcast, greatest podcast of all time. Appreciate this. Yeah, this is the best podcast of my <laughs> life. <laughs> <laughs> I love you guys so much. Cheers. Oh, cheers. Uh. <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> Worst tequila I've ever had in my life. Really? I thought it was good. What kind of was it? I thought it was good. I was just joking. Yeah. I like how you refuse to say the name of it. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's fine. Joe, I, I was, uh, I, I, um, when I met you, you were a lot thinner. 
<laughs> I was? Yeah. Yeah. And what's amazing it to happens, me is yeah, that yeah. I've watched you chain smoke cigarettes and one would think that that would make your skin look bad. And yet your yeah. skin is immaculate. It's stretched yeah. out. And that's exactly my thought. You've yeah. expanded to push the wrinkles yeah. out of your face. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. don't Holy understand. Shit, dude. Honestly, honestly. You said Francis, I ate the elders I in my that's, town. Yeah, that's for earlier. Francis. <laughs> Francis has been dying. I can't, I can't argue that. with you. I can't argue with you. I I was on a Zoom the other night with my friend, and uh, she goes, oh, my hair is getting gray. And I go, really? I go, I don't know what I'm doing, but I go, it's nothing's having yeah. an effect. <laughs> you know, I, I should be withered at this point. Yeah. Yeah. No, you look great. No wrinkles are kicking in. Yeah, that, you know, so, Hair's still curly yeah. and full. Yeah. 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 You, know. you do something with that hair. You're keeping it. He mooses it. For I don't sure. do shit with this yeah, hair, dog. Yeah, you do. I don't it's, do shit with this hair. Don't fucking like, cover you know me. I'm I trying do? to say you have nice hair. Yeah, you know what I do with this hair? Rite Aid shampoo, dude. That's it. Really? Bullshit. That's bullshit. Yeah. You're leaving something in there. That's you have nice. Rite Aid it's shampoo. Shiny. No, I, I use a product, but I don't what product dye do you it. Use? Nothing. You no. use product mm. on your hair? What is it? Uh, sea salt spray. Mm. Mm. <laughs> the blue bottle? I've uh, seen that. I get it on uh, Amazon, so I don't know the name of the product, but I use a sea salt spray. Just hammered. In the morning, spraying <laughs> sea salt shit in your hair. <laughs> I gotta go make some sandwiches. <laughs> yeah. 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 I got a hurricane. I got a hurricane and a grenade glass. Yeah. Uh, oh, uh, sea salt. Oh man. man, I love DeRosa's. I love call. I call him. He's always sad. It's yeah. great. We're both always hungover. Yeah, it's nice. It's like we gotta Shane cut this out, call- man. Shane's another dude. Shane's another dude that people say like, uh, he's a. He might be a dick. He's never, this. He's this. Never heard anyone say that about him. He calls it. No, people say it all the time. All the, well, you and I say it. The, uh, <laughs> but no, he'll call me in the morning and he'll be like, what's up, dude? And I go, nothing. What's going on? He goes, just call and check on you, dude. Are you good, dude? Like, Well, uh, that's because you, you were are sad you, this whole are year. You happy? Like, you guys are the best guys I fucking know. And it's the best night of your I life, love it. Dude. You guys are just the <laughs> this best. This is the ever. best Cinco de Mayo ever. This is no, I know. Let's, let's remember the Cinco de Mayo forever, guys. This is going to die. This is going to die tonight. I'm going to drop dead later. At the end of this episode, there'll just be an in memoriam. Take a, <laughs> can we do a jump up and take a fire? Yeah. Yeah. Joe dies that night. Yeah. We did it at we did, one of the funniest things I ever heard. We did an apartment crawl in LA when I lived in LA. Ugh. And uh, I go, uh, it was at Christmas. We, no, no. Listen, this is really funny. We did an apartment crawl in LA at Christmas, and I go, guys, we need to do this every year. This is so special. And then Pete Holmes goes, Joe died later that day. Damn, <laughs> me and Pete Holmes on the same page. Anyway, it was fun. Dang, it's just name dropping. Yeah. Big dogging. That's how you stay young looking. Big yeah. dogging. Me and Dave Navarro, Woo. we're fucking. <laughs> what, a weird, what a weird one to throw in. Yeah. <laughs> Dave he went to like, he just, as he was saying it, he was like, which celebrity, which celebrity? And just Dave Navarro <laughs> threw in there. Me and Tig Notaro. <laughs> <laughs> Powerhouse. Yeah. We, uh, we went to Chris D'Elia's house. Whoa, um, dude. Shots at the LA comics. Is that how you feel? Yeah. Shots. Shots. Take his, yo, yeah. How you feel about Speaking the LA of shots, guys? Shots, dude. Speaking of shots, me and fucking Tig Notaro were doing shots. Really? Yeah. Yeah, with Joe Rogan. And, uh, <laughs> and then what happened? Know, I'm, not, I'm just naming people. I've been listening to Leah's podcast. It's pretty good. Really? Yeah, it's I have. He's funny. He still does it. I love his podcast. Yeah, he's back doing Who? it. D'Elia. Oh, oh, yeah. It's all he talks about. What's that? Shots with the, me? The Chargers now. The Chargers brought against him. <laughs> <laughs> he's a Chargers fan? No, he talks about the Chargers brought against him. For like three hours a night. It's pretty good. Does he actually talk about it? Uh, I don't listen. I'm just kidding. I don't listen. Me and F. Murray Abraham. <laughs> <laughs> They're at Brian De Palma's house. Yes. Mm. With Chris D'Elia and <laughs> Tignataro. <Tignotaro. laughs> <laughs> and what happened? Ah, we were all fucking hanging, dude. It was and then fucking <laughs> Fallon came in and started titty fucking you. <laughs> Down <laughs> came in and fucking. He said, "I, I saw on it. Joe's tits." <laughs> I saw I saw F. Murray Abraham play Shylock uh, the Jew. That's oh. his name in um, oh, uh, Merchant of Venice and brought in on on stage. It was really good. Nice. You, you know went to a show with Tiger? Was Tiger Notaro was her real name? Really? Yeah. And somebody's like, "Who's titty fucking?" And she reached into her pocket. And she's like, "Here's one. You can fuck." 
True story. All of it. <laughs> Seriously, for real, cut that part out. <laughs> Man. Damn. Matt, you got any tight celeb stories? Other nah, than just, this? Other than sharing the mic with the celeb? Yeah, this is it. I'll be tell, I'm going to be talking about this later. You're going to be going back to the bars in Delco. I mean, like, had a wild night with Michael Richards, dude. Yeah, dude. With Michael Richards? <laughs> no, I, dude, I met the dad from Elf once. Yeah? Yeah, he was what? in front of me in line in Hermosa Beach at a Starbucks. And I was like, just fucking dad from Elf. I just nodded to him. I didn't really meet him. Meet him. Yeah, you know, like, was it like, did you ever see the crack house pictures of him? Of the dad from Elf? Yeah. No? <laughs> you Honestly, Ari, you never saw those? No, I, dude, hope you're like, already, I hope you're already looking up crack house pictures of a dad from Elf. No, he's on his phone texting. Yeah, he's fucking, fucking around. You're trying to get pussy? because He's texting his other open mic phone. buddies <laughs> saying, you guys aren't going to believe no, who's down <laughs> here. <laughs> Joe DeRosa and Tig Nataro. <laughs> he's in a oh, there's, there's like, there's like actual real photos <laughs> of the dad from Elf in a crack house before he died. No, what? He's dead? Yeah, he he's died. Dead? Oh, he it's died real. right after Starbucks. All right, it's what's this guy's name? Real, I promise You're you. Your producer? No, what's this guy's name? <laughs> Max. <laughs> Max. Um, Mild mannered. Nope, that's right. not it. Max Wright. Max Wright. Max Wright. Whoa, this picture of him in a crack, and he's about to, he's about to kiss a dude, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, he was having fun at a that's crack a house. Mm-hmm. What's going on, on bottom right? Who the fuck got in there and took those pics? Shit, to his gay partner left, and then, gay, his happy partner. Sure. Yeah. And then the two exchange the smoke. Oh, some other guy comes in and just takes his clothes off immediately. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, that's a, a party. That's a fucking party. <laughs> Shotgun some yes. crack. Yikes. Well, that's such a fucked wild, up. Dude. That's such a shitty thing to do to somebody after they mm-hmm. die is be like, yo, look at them being gay and doing drugs. No, so I don't just care. let the man I mean, die. I respect yeah. it. I'm Damn. Just... They brought, also, a, they brought Alf, a bull into the mix. Alf star. Yeah, they brought a bull. That's it. Damn, look at that. That's such a funny like comic book layout, too. It is. Of that storyline. Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> it's, like yeah. <laughs> it's like Stanhope. It's like Stanhope. Kapow! That, <laughs> that he, that he uh, uh, historically was uh, so against Alf, and they were like, after the last episode, he walked off the set and didn't talk to anybody. He was like, I'm, I'm, I'm above this. And then, like, did the picture coming out of the crack house came out. Uh-huh. That's, that's what's so funny about it to me. Yeah. You know, yeah. but yeah. I now, like how they call him Alf Star, where I'm like, mm, Alf is the star. He's just on Alf. True. Shocking celebrity. Who was it? Was it Foley that ran into Philip Seymour Hoffman? Yes. Dude, it's so he He's saw Philip out. Seymour Philip Seymour Hoffman on heroin, like riding his bike in New York, and Foley was like, "Yo, Phil," <laughs> and he said, "He said he just kept pedaling." Like, he, he, he had his arms down. He had his arms down. No, H Foley. H Hank. Oh, oh. He had like his Hank arms. He said he said he had his arms straight down and was just pedaling. No, and like clearly oh, on heroin. God. And he was yeah. like, "Yo, Phil." <laughs> He's just. Was I, like, was with, uh, <laughs> I was with Joey and Grigioni one night. We were going to a diner in New York. Can you, it, can you do a running count of name drops? <laughs> it's, it's I like haven't heard of any it's so of annoying, these people. Dude. It's so annoying. Anyway, we're going to a diner. Do you think they drop you? Are they like I was at? The, it's you like think there's when, no reason to say a name there. Just like I was with my buddy. Right, I was a fr- I was with my friend Joanne. <laughs> I just said it because I was just like, joking, you guys were joking, you. dude. We're just anyway, goofing we're with you. Anyway, we were going to a diner to get dinner one night, and we 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 saw a taxi cab crash into a scaffolding, and the scaffolding crashed. Oh. It was one of the worst accidents I've ever seen, right? <laughs> it was insane. A kid stumbled out of the back of the cab covered in blood, and we, what? like, helped him because we were like, dude, are you okay? Like, what do you need? And we were it was standing. Ralph Macchio? No, we were, no. I swear to God, we were standing there and watching. Joanne was like, we're, Whoa, we're giving Ralph Schneider a special. Cody's popping We were standing shittle. there watching the whole Cody's thing. Cody's about to cuck you, dude. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> we were standing there watching the whole thing unfold. Yeah. That was that was. And a crowd was gathering. And all of a sudden, Philip Seymour Hoffman rode up on his 10 speed. It was just what? like, oh. <laughs> and I looked at Joanne and she goes, only in New York. Yeah. <laughs> I was oh, like, yeah, that's this is insane. Damn, dude. Amazing that yeah, you're, that he had the for- ability to count the gears on his bike. I, I don't. He's still oh, coming at you. Oh, got him. We're right. getting him. I told right. you, Francis. I've forgotten. All right, I'm getting shit hat. <laughs> Francis is a motherfucker. I'm sorry, Joe. I love you. No, stop. The uh, Francis it wasn't a great story, you. but it was it was weird. No, it's, it's a great a, story. 
Was Philip Seymour Hoffman have found an accident and you watched Philip Seymour Hoffman <laughs> no, that's pretty it, good it, like ingest an accident. It's yeah, it's like, <laughs> 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 yeah, he had him up all set. Yeah, it's it's funny. Francis, it's you have an enemy now. Francis is going to be angrily jerking off your pictures is for like three years, dude. Psycho. <laughs> He's dude. smelling his tuft of fucking pubes. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> Blow him in his face and knock him out. Yeah. Francis is a psycho. <laughs> take, take his panini nah, press. That's why I roll with him, dude. Hell this yeah, is my dude. squad. I know this guy's willing to kill anyone. Francis is a hitter, dude. Francis is my number one hitter. I want to hit people. Francis is just fucking nuts. Dude. I'm rolling with him harder than you are, dude. Francis hates your guts, dude. <laughs> Fuck that, dude. We're boys. True. True. Yo, you know we're boys, right? <laughs> Fucking boys, dude, I'm gonna dude. do that. There was a there was True. a comic here last night that hates me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna name. Oh, I know who. But no, 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 she forwarded me the email. I appreciate the sentiment. He was trying to someone hit someone hit someone up. hit up an ex. What? Oh God! Wait, what? To try to fuck her? No, to try to be like you should have. No, never Just mind. Just motherfucker. Uh, no, he yeah. wasn't. Oh, never mind. Come on, man. What happened? Well, it's I don't want to. It's only going to encourage more of it, so I don't want to do that. I'll tell you what encouraged more of it when you said. Hey fans, don't email this lady. Don't email They're any of my family members or relationships. Please. Wait, what were you gonna bring up? Some chick who hates you. Oh yeah, that's uh, what we hear. yeah, that's yeah. what we want to hear. Fuck, I forget. Pretty what tight, I was someone say. though. No, you remember now that we brought it up again? No, no, but just exactly how it just. Yeah, I'm gonna do that to her. That's what I think I was gonna do. Just hit her, be like, yo. I'm gonna see her and be like, yo, you know we're fucking boys, right? Because <laughs> last I tried to do that to her like 12 Just times. Like, we're boys to the end. Last <laughs> night, <laughs> over, over. Yeah. No, no, no. They'll oh, figure text it out. It to me under the table. I won't say. It. Don't worry about it. No, we'll no, tell no. you after because it's gonna be a problem. Text to me. Don't we're gonna have to delete it if they text find it out. Text it to me under the table. I won't say anything. Because they'll all like at it. her on Twitter. You can delete it if I say anything. I will not say anything. I just want to know right now. Text it to me under the table. Yeah. No, no, don't do it. We're yeah. gonna end in fucking. Oh, true. Yeah, yeah, he's drunk. Done. He's gonna tell me. Look, trust an Egyptian with shit, with true. information. Are you, Are you nuts? Orders from him now? You taking orders from him? Do it. Do it. I'm not taking orders. Oh well, now you put it like that. Do yeah, I'm gonna do tell him. Says. Do it. After, say after. <laughs> Both of you guys are fucking say after. Do idiots. What I say, not what he says. Anyway, what, what I'm going to say to her next time is, you. Yo, you know me are fucking, you guys, you and me are fucking boys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get hammered and get in her fuck <laughs> just in her grill. I love you guys, man. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, he hates you. me. Who? This lady, dude. <laughs> Text it to me under the goddamn table. We're done. All right. We're done. Text nah, don't do that. We're done. Don't do what he says. Do what I say. Oh, do what I say, not what he says. What's Stop up? Barring. Oh, we're not done yet. Um, write it on his leg. But yeah, I saw it last night. Yeah, just just do like write spell it on his back, like touch his back no, in the letter. I even got off. I even got off stage. Under the table and I was like, and I, will not say I got off stage and I was like, you're gonna do great. And she was just like, <laughs> 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 I was so trying. Great. I kept That's fucking so with her. Great. I kept being like. Yo, yeah. hey, Special how are you? Don't take it. You're killing her with kindness. Yeah. Kind of. I was trying no, so no, hard no. to be like, yo, what's up? And she was just like, no. It was Joy Behar, wasn't it? It was that bitch Joy <laughs> Behar. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking. Whoopi Goldberg. I'm going to keep guessing. <laughs> These people aren't no. here. They're yeah. not. They're yeah. not. Yeah. That was the joke. Damn, Francis is on you, dude. You fucking ass. I'm watching you. Joe, I'm watching you. And your face counts. Francis, how bad? For real though, real talk. No, yo, real talk. No, no cap. Right now, yeah, no cap. How bad would you beat the fuck out of Derosa? Like, no. what would you do to him if he broke into your house tonight? If Derosa cat burglared you like the Egyptian no. thief that he is, <laughs> if he tried to, if he tried to rob one of your we grandparents' to your tombs. Hookah. No, no. <laughs> like a true Egyptian, he tried to no, rob your grandpa's friend. tomb. Yeah. He was just drawing like an eyeball on if something. Brought, if he took, if brought scarabs to your house. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> What's a scarab? I don't know, like a big beetle. It's a beetle. Yeah, what if Is he started really? drawing like uh, hmm. hieroglyphics and he spray painted a fucking... Yeah, but like <laughs> mean ones, you know? Yeah. Mean yeah. hieroglyphics. You know what would you do about? if you caught him spray painting hieroglyphics? On I would um, like a dude with an alligator head. Francis, yeah. don't buy into this. We're, come on, <laughs> nah, dude, you got to defend your parents' don't house. Leave. I know, <laughs> I know. It's not you; it's your parents. What yeah. would you do? Involved in that? 
If I saw Joe DeRosa spray painting, spray painting, painting hieroglyphics, hieroglyphics. Oh, <laughs> in my parents' house, is that yeah. what On I'm on the front inside? Door? Inside, Were they, the fumes might get them. I'd sure. be like, man, I, I did not know this guy yeah, but as then well as I thought him? I did. Yeah. You caught him in the act. You caught I him in the act. Like, <laughs> push, like pushing you too. I didn't fingers, know he had this in him. You're looking down from the second floor of your parents' house and you see him. Yes, that's who I thought he was. I'd immediately flying scroll because I know it's gonna be a soft landing. So. Oh, oh, bitch ass. Oh. He, he said he's gonna jump on you from the second floor to be a soft landing. Damn, oh, it would be though. <laughs> Come on, dude. Whoopi, I'm a mushy shit, dude. It's like, his also, right, his house is built on a sinkhole. <laughs> dude, it's not. Damn. Fuck him up. Me under Structurally the table. Oh my don't god. Do don't do I'll tell you don't after. Don't do no, I'm not gonna. Yeah. I'm not gonna yeah. indulge in yeah. this garbage. Absolutely. I commanded you not. I to. met um, Harrison Ford once. That was a oh, better. Oh yeah, you met him. Oh wait, listen to this. This is crazy. What happened? Yeah. What? Listen to how rich. Oh, listen to how rich this I guy was, is. I uh, was. I was nine. Nine years old. Yep. And uh, my mom went to college what with college? a woman. What college? She Princeton. <laughs> it was the first <laughs> class of women in Princeton. My dad went to Clarion. <laughs> <laughs> Never heard of it. So it's uh, <laughs> like a Macinta. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, it really is. It's out. My dad went to Pittsburgh. Bonner High School. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> my dad went to Temple of Doom. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yes. This guy. <laughs> your dad went. Your dad went to Sphinx High School. <laughs> Yeah, dude. Got him. Egyptian joke? Yeah, God, he's at. Yeah, God, he's at. Don't make me put Francis back on you. True. Dude. Francis is a whale on you. <laughs> yeah. What? what? Oh, shit. Oh. What? I didn't go to a weight watcher. Fuck. You failed out of weight watchers. That's so funny. Shane eats snack wells desserts. Exactly. You know what I mean? He's got a. Yeah. Cupboard full of uh, you want to get you want to get fucked. No, I don't. I don't want your ass. You, <laughs> I, 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 I give my belly. <laughs> your pimple turned on yeah, you. He doesn't eat snack, bro. <laughs> He's fat. <laughs> <laughs> just knock off. <laughs> I mean, I'll tell you what I did. The ultimate mistake is going. I didn't go to <laughs> the funniest. Thing, I know what's going to happen now. It's just a nice Reddit rumor that I went, that went, went to Weight Watchers. Watch. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Yo, all right, well, I'll stop. Hold on, dude. I, I did. I have gone to Zumba a couple times. Nice. Uh, O'Connor discovered uh, a certain subreddit where they make fun of a certain podcast today. And it's the funniest, like he got on there and was like, it's so funny knowing there's just a subreddit of like 20,000 dudes that are just constantly hateful. I feel like the fighter of the kid. Oh yeah, yeah the fighter of the kid exactly. subreddit. Yeah, yeah. A certain it's like subreddit. 50, it's so gloriously funny and it's creative. It's so funny. And it's like, maybe the fighter of the kid is actually great because of what they spawned, this creative environment. True. Mm -hmm. Perhaps. There you go. Well, what's the new? That's a good way to look at it. Wait, wait, what's there? Oh, sorry, sorry, oh, sorry, yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. My mom went to college with a woman who, years after they and left college, ended up marrying the king of Jordan, King Hussein. Okay. Her name was Lisa yeah. Halaby. The she guy who Queen beheaded your parents. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan was always uh, allied with all the. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. True. And uh, Israel, <laughs> Israel, like you know anything about it? Yeah. I know exactly what Israel had to come down. And give I just him said, what for? Yeah, I just go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He literally could have been like, you know, Hitler was a good guy. I was like, oh, no, no, uh -huh. yeah, 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 yeah. Also, Sorry, but yeah, Israel gave them right. what for? Your people just butt fucked his people. Oh yeah, they tried to start shit, and you guys seven days war rocked said no. them. Said dude. no, every mm -hmm. war. How about every war? Yeah. Yeah. You guys Damn. rocked them. It was one sided. Dude. A bunch of Derosas came running across yeah, you the came, field. You came at us with chariots, and we're like, you don't want that shit. <laughs> Yo, bro, you know we're fucking you boys. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck, so, dude? So, your mom's friend <laughs> became a princess. Uh, yeah, yes, um, sorry, oh, queen. Sorry, sorry. The queen? queen. The queen of Jordan. Yeah. The queen. And then they had kids. And, well, anyway, the whole point is when they went and filmed uh, The Last Crusade, Indiana yeah. Jones and The Last Crusade, they Probably the filmed best. that at in Jordan. That scene in the end where they go there. into the temple, it's called... Yeah. Petra. Petra. It's a, yeah. like a landmark, a historic landmark. They carved, they carved shit into a fucking wall. Giant yeah. temple, like three-story temple into yeah. the fucking mountain. Damn. It looks so That's Duros' cool. ancestors. It used to be <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. like a stop for people yeah. who are going across the desert to like fuel up, basically. Mm -hmm. um, and in order to get that, they had to get the permission from the king, obviously. And then he was into it. Spielberg, Spielberg was, was the director, and so they were like he was going down to the film set every day and he became good friends with Harrison Ford. 
we went to their 25th wedding anniversary in England. I was nine years old. And, and this is at the time of Last Crusade. It was after, like, but, but he not had far after. He had yeah, and he had maintained okay. his friendship with okay. uh, with the king. Got and it. so I like I was young, and we were sitting there at the table, and this helicopter comes over the house, this massive mansion, mm -hmm. lands in the garden, and out steps Harrison Ford, who had been flying the helicopter yeah, with yeah. the <laughs> king of Jordan. They were just taking a joyride. Yeah. And they came up and sat at this table with us. And I uh, ended up talking to him for like, and then we went and planted a tree together. You talked to Indiana Jones and planted yeah. a tree? And I'm nine years old. I'm what? freaking out, what? dude. And he's still like Han in Solo. Like Han Solo. Dude, he's young. Yeah. Indiana Jones shape. Yeah, yeah. Right? This is not wrinkled. So he's hot as hell. You know, oh, gravelly. Dude, so awesome. you have a it, was the it was the best like celebrity thing I could have so had. That's so awesome, yeah. When dude. I was nine years old. And and then we and we, there's pictures of us like walking me and Harrison walking through the gardens together like planting this tree to commemorate their 25 years of marriage. So you were, oh, you were like man, you and Indiana absolutely. Jones had like a oh, Michael Jackson Macaulay Culkin thing. Just about. Pretty and tight. and there's one last piece <laughs> and this is the best part. Uh, at the end of this like whatever dinner, the he ended up get, getting a piece of the Royal Jordanian official stationery, and he wrote a note to me and he goes to Francis. May the force be with you always, Harrison Ford. Yo, I Harrison, still have that. Harrison Ford is definitely trying to fuck you. How great <laughs> is that? Are you kidding? I have me? that letter. Yeah, have it? yeah. You have it framed? I, I don't have it framed, but show I, I Joe the picture. Show show the show the because show the Joe's like a fucking huge show dork for this Why shit. Why would it not be framed? Why would you not frame that? That's I just, why would you I, not? I gotten around to you, it, you know what Indiana Jones is based <laughs> off of? I haven't gotten around. Egyptian to it. grave robbers. No, it was based off of the guy who went to study, I think it was like Zoroastrianism. Oh, yeah. Did you ever see that? Yeah. Did you ever read about the real Indiana like, Jones? Yeah. yeah. It's awesome. He was like, par it was this paranoid guy who would pull guns on everyone. He went to India. Hmm. Just pulled guns on everyone. Really? Nice. And yeah. that's what it was like. It's a Frenchman. This, and he, was like, he was just fucked up. Wow, it was a crazy that's Frenchman. That's sick, dude. What? Dude, he's. Come on, where's dude. his other hand? I have to get that frame, I see it. Dude. Well, I like to look at it. Man, man, I love young Francis, too. Yeah, man. He was a little snack. He yeah. was. A little strawberry Damn. shortcake. <laughs> I'm gonna like it because you liked it. Oh, it's his own <laughs> thing. It's my own. Yeah. <laughs> it's his, you know, it's his no, phone, don't right? Comment. <laughs> <laughs> Just comments the N word. <laughs> I was commenting, I rule. <laughs> oh. like, I'll leave the like, though. I do like it. You gotta get that frame. I know, dude. I know, That's I will. Amazing. Yeah. That's and it's got so the cool. emblem and the seal. Call him up right now. Really call quick. Up. Call him up. Do you have his number? Fuck. No. Fast forward, uh, like, I don't know, 12 or 14 years. She's gone through puberty. Now yeah, the king yeah, has passed tough. away of yeah. Jordan. And so she's now the queen mother. She's no longer the queen because obviously the, their, the son became the king. <laughs> oh, shit. And, um, and I'm seated at a table for her, their 60th birthday, for the queen's 60th birthday. We're at the same estate in Ascot, England. And now I'm like 25, whatever. And I'm sitting next to Princess Iman, mm -hmm. their daughter, who was named one of People Magazine's 25 hottest royals under 25. And I'm hitting on her all night. And we're like drinking and I'm like, man, this is going great. I'm like firing off jokes. I ask her if she wants to go for a walk in Whoa. the gardens. Very Whoa. princely. We go, Very princely. We go out to the fountains and I lean in to kiss her and what? she backs away and she goes, what are you doing? Oh my God. And oh, I was no. like, oh my God, I'm sorry. I, I just totally misread this. She goes, if my brothers see you try to do that, they'll kill you. You destroyed her honor. You're not Arab. And I was like, oh, my God. And they meant it. Her her brothers, uh, Prince Abdullah and Hashim, were uh, right there up on the, like, dance floor or whatever. They almost there. jumped down and squashed Well, you. they didn't yeah. see us. But, like, I didn't They're think that finger I was. Patrol. I was Why just like. Why did you fucking lead you on like that? I know. But it t I'm so glad that I tried. That was a test, dude. I'm so glad I tried. That was I just tried. a test. You, you could have been the prince. I took a shot at kissing a princess. Nah, that was a I, test, dude. They were, were testing you like, your metal. You said that where you're like, no, but I'm better than an Arab. Yeah. <laughs> that's that yeah i'm glad I, i'm glad i laid it on the line though did you yeah. think i was jewish <laughs> that's pretty cool that's crazy man that features that's philip seymour hoffman's man. story by that's every every wow. once in a while like francis from like i hate to be that this is the hackiest thing you can say when someone's like in comedy from but dude you're a loser <laughs> what? what do you mean? You went to Qualified Harvard. <laughs> you were eating. You knew Harrison Ford. You were at like a royal dinner, and you're like, "I'm gonna go to this open mic night." Yeah, and you know what must be sad <laughs> for you, you guys is no, that no. I'm doing 
pretty well. Why are you hanging no, out with good. us? No, it's good. No. Why are you not hanging out with like Al Pacino? <laughs> because and I wanted to prove to you bums that even <laughs> as someone who doesn't need it can still succeed. No, but that's Damn. stupid. I'm just kidding. go hang yeah, just out succeed. with uh, <laughs> Yeah, just succeed. You, you don't have to be a dick about it. I'm being I'm kidding. You don't have to be like I shouldn't have said it. I'm this is like Mario Batali we're going working at McDonald's. Like, what are you doing, dude? Yeah, we all this is my I'm having more fun here than I ever did with Princess Iman, you know? True. Harrison yeah, Ford. She's like, you're coming yeah. to she America. She wishes she could be here. Yeah. Fair she got enough. divorced shortly after. All she right. got married and then shortly divorced shortly really? after that. She went to Sandhurst. Text her, dude. Which is the British uh, like Naval Academy. Okay. Or Army Academy. Shane's brother got into there. <laughs> Shane Gillis, he hosts his podcast. I got in. No, it was me. I got in. You got a West Point. Oh, the thing. fuck, dude? You're going to disrespect me on this thing? <laughs> he's a fucking troop, I'm dude. a troop. You're what? You're a troop? Yeah, he's a Technically, West Point. yeah. We're troops. You know what's funny? Anytime we talk about it, people are like, Shane needs to shut the fuck up. It's like, dude, I know it was a failure. Yeah. You got into West Point? Did you leave when the I chick went. got in? I went for three weeks. And you quit when and then the, I quit. the VMI let in, let in? As soon as I, <laughs> yes. As soon as I saw women, I was like, I'm out. I'm out. You really went to West Point for three weeks? Yes. And they're like, you fuck. They, in your face, like, hey, dude, that's not cool. That's I'm actually exactly man. what happened. They started yelling at me and they're like, where the fuck are you going? I was like, I'm going home. They're like, don't do that, dude. Uh, hey, like, they on, instantly they try to talk you out of it. Yes. Oh, yeah. They changed their tune. Immediately. They're like, dude, it's not so bad. Recruited football player. Damn. I should do that on stage. If I don't get a joke well, I'm like, I'm leaving. I'm going to leave <laughs> the crowd. Like, no, 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 come on, come on, come on. Boy. Someone yeah. in the crowd be like, yo, please. Come on, like, man. Fine. Start right, packing right. your bag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going home. I'm <laughs> things. Yeah. All right. Well, I think we've reached. I Joe, you, you about sobered up yet? Oh, shit. Huh? You fucking drunk. Oh fuck you, dude! There he is. <laughs> like, that's the that's the eyes I want. I want a couple drinks in you. I want a side he eyes. He's like, right by you. Eh, he's those basset hound eyes. Eh. <laughs> Great time, Joe. You want a lady? Apple? You want a, 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 a pink lady apple? No. Ooh. Right. You're good. All right, yeah, I'll have one. Wow. <laughs> yeah, let's munch apples. Fresh. Oh. <laughs> hey man. Hey hey Joe. Damn. This is starting a food fight. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> Damn, dude! <laughs> All right, yeah, stop this. This is done. No, what? Why? We've had enough. You ruined it. You can't yeah, be dude. throwing apples. This isn't fucking rompous time. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs>